Hey, we are recording. All right, yeah, this right. is uh, Scummy Resellers yeah. Podcast number three. Action, whatever. Um, before we get started talking about the topic that AJ and I had said, oh, that's a good topic to talk about. Ooh, money on the floor. Ooh. Money? Oh, that's AJ. AJ's always dropping money. Yeah. But before we get started, next I'm gonna film. Market. I'm gonna film this separately. Um, okay, I'm recording. Uh, uh, Daryl is graciously uh, selling off a bit of his collection, stuff that he doesn't re need right now. And uh, I've said it before, but Daryl's house is loaded. He's uh, a big collector, has a, a really nice, huge collection Stop of... Stop the wheelchair, you can't do anything. Yeah, well, he can't use it right now, so he'd rather have the money than just look at stuff. But, alright, so what today are the amazing things that Daryl's willing to let go of? Oh, and then I got a gift for you, I'll show that too. More can be added after the podcast. So we yeah, yeah, yeah. So we, we can add that in later, yeah, yeah. If, if if need be. And I'll just this, what I'm doing is I'm recording all of us now, but then this will be like the excerpts of stuff that people wouldn't be able to see because otherwise we'd have to take it and bring it over to the camera and go, oh, he's trading this. It's, this is much faster, and this will just be a separate video in itself. All right, I what do you want to start with? Two is in there. Now we're not talking prices or anything now. This AJ is going to be like yeah. super fair with Daryl and basically pay more than pretty much anybody else would do. Uh, this the stuff that uh, AJ is getting is mostly for his collection. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'm, I'm doing well, a little bit of you and Charlie. All I'm going to do is I'm going to switch. Stuff. Every one of those games went off eBay. Yeah. Yeah. You for, pulled for off eBay or? or I bought off eBay. Oh, you I bought off eBay. You know your eBay top price for them. You know? Right. All right. Well, come on, let's go through with the right. shipping. And then we could sit and talk about other. What do we got here? Near your pocket. Working perfectly, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it works good. It works perfect. Yeah, you got that off me, right? You got yeah. the game in it. That's one I had there. I saw it. He's like, I won. Actually, did you guys have a little yes, tip did. about it? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, you uh, I thought that. I said I wanted it, and Adrian's like, I didn't know. That one's got history to it. But look, you know what? In the end, yeah. you in know, the end, our history. Yeah. In the end, you get to, yeah. Like you, you two I guys played together. it. Problem is, even when I could play with two hands, I couldn't see it. Yeah. The, unless you got a backlit. I have a backlit one at home. Oh, you do? Well, well I guess you I want to have it modded, right? but is this one cleaner or never do it? Much cleaner. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that a shame? Well, I might keep it. I might keep two. Yeah, maybe just keep two. Like one that's not modded and one yeah. that's legit. I really, All right. I originally so which games had, are you I originally thinking? had the camouflage blue one and the silver one. So I always wanted a silver one back. I always wanted to find a camouflage blue one again. Oh really? I've never seen it. I was going to buy one on eBay, but it was over 100. Wow. I'm playing Probably Turf Masters. Are oh, you playing Turf Masters? Well, go through the games that that you're, you are getting with this. Are you getting all the games? Or? Oh, yeah. Well, this is last play in Japanese, Wait a minute. right? Just hold it. Like, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Last play? No. Mm -hmm. Last blade. Last this blade. American version. American version of last blade. Same game. Yeah. Huh. Oh, yeah, fighters. Probably one and two because I like them so much. I think I bought one and two. Sure. What do you got in there? It's all I think it's called Falsy. Samurai Showdown 2. Samurai Showdown 2. Yeah. Oh, so this is the rare one. This is Falsy. Yeah, Falsy. That's the one you said is like big money, right? Yeah, it's so hard to find. Yeah. How much is that worth? Right now, anywhere from like 75 to 100, sometimes less than that. Yeah, I, I know. Yeah. I, I bought that one a while right. back. How much did you pay? So I paid about 75. Yeah, Even okay. back then. Yeah, back yeah. then. Well, these games aren't getting easier to find. When I was when I was really collecting for this, I was trying to get every game for it. Yeah. You know? How many games are so there I was for paying, it? I was paying up for them. How many games are there in the system? I'm not sure how many. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. So now, we'll show this. Now, this is the one that Daryl bought offline. You bought two of them and you pieced them together. No, the other one was broken. It was so beyond I, repair. I fixed it. I fixed it to get it working, and then I resold it. Oh, okay. So this one was working. And, and unfortunately, I was trying to be scummy, but I didn't make anything on it. Not a cent. But that's what that's what collectors do. They buy, and then they'll resell to basically pay for their collection. All right, keep going. Now what's this? Japanese slots. Now make sure you try to charge. Now why do you want this? Just give it to me. Oh, that's see, if that doesn't design. take a charge, it might need a battery. Okay. Okay. All right, uh, Raymond. Yes, mm -hmm. but the battery's easy Why to not? get for that. Okay. Does that have value? No, but it's just a you nice. need it. No, it's okay. Fill it for the store. Okay. This I don't know. It's just sealed. Shifting world. Yeah, I guess, and it's an unusual game. Yeah. I've never heard of it. So. And, and next we have some GameCube. If we have time. Well, you want to show the game? This ki the actual yeah. GameCube first. Yeah, have you been wanting one of these? It's just a skin. Yeah, but have you been wanting one of those? What do you mean? I mean, are you going to keep it or are you going to sell it? 
probably going to keep it. Okay. So then you've been wanting one. All right. I have the another marrow one that's going to go to you. It has a player on the bottom. All right. You want to go through? Yeah. And it has a screen. I oh, got, yeah, I got, I had I one got, of those. It has a screen and a player in a bottle, so you can take it with you. Man, I don't remember if I sold it or what. I got stuff it's like, like one around. compact unit. Having the store is going to... Man, I remember this. What? That's my price sticker, dude. Is it? Yeah. Not Mario Party is this. Yeah. That's I'll my price sticker. That. See? TP. Yeah, that means test play. games I bought from you. Or Tiny Penis. <laughs> <laughs> now that AJ has it. <laughs> All right, come on. <laughs> oh, so you just did GameCube. Uh... Yeah, I mean, it's still... Break it up. Some of it, yeah. some, some of it's no, fair. this is good filler stuff, so, you know. Uh, you want to just show the game cover instead of the sides? I mean, Wait, I hold on, I'm missing one. You're missing no, one? No, 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 I'm not. Okay. I'm making that beautiful gel, one and two. Beautiful gel. All right, let's go through this. Okay. Cubix, this Wait. is cheap, but it's just... You, you need it? This game. Yeah, that yeah. used to be rare as yeah. hell. Yeah, yeah, it's still probably rare, just nobody's paying nobody's up for paying it. For it. Okay. Mario Sunshine, we all know the deal with this. Yeah, it's super easy to sell. Yeah. Uh, it's a fantastic game. Uh, and super easy. Mario Golf. Uh, it's Mario not easy to sell, but you can put it online. Beautiful Joe, I don't have it, so I'm keeping yeah, it. Yeah, keep it. Mario, you know, just. Yeah, easy to sell. Easy to sell. That's easy 10 bucks. Yep. Uh, bottom, I do not have this. What is it? Bottom man. Oh, really? Is this, I don't is see this a right. reseal? It's a reseal, right? Yeah. Who resealed it? I you just, still want it? I don't know. I mean, I, well, I've never seen Zoo so I think, I, in my opinion, it's a rare game. This this is worthless. It's like a five dollar game. What is that? But it's Universal Studios. Oh yeah, it's kind of cool, that's though. probably a lot of fun. <laughs> I believe that it is. Fun. Is it? Uh, what the hell with that game? Challenge be? sealed. I don't know. That looks like a seal because it's got like this sticker on it. That's original seal. This this is original Mario, seal. <laughs> Mario Party from Tony. From from me with my stupid TP sticker. Uh, Star Wars. He he had a few of these over there. Yeah. You Where are so many? You have like. T you should have bought five, buy them all, man. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, man. Well, maybe later. That's true. I'll probably grab more later. Okay. Sonic Director's Cut, easy $10. Yeah. Never saw this one. Smashing Drive, I've seen it's it. It's a fun game, man. Yeah. Did you I get it from that, me? I bought that because I like Crazy Taxi. Then you didn't get it from me. Oh, Beautiful uh, Joe Beautiful too. Joe Ju 2. Uh, Monkey Ball. Super Monkey Ball, easy sell. Probably. I was going to buy fun a Smashing Drive machine. What happened? I don't like Super Monkey Ball. It's like annoying. I love Super Monkey Ball. Uh, oh, Metroid that? 2. Metroid 2. Battalion Wars. Battalion Wars, I'm not familiar with. Never saw this one. Dark oh, I've seen it. Never seen that one. Dark and Sky. Never. Bomberman Generations. That's, wait a minute. So there's more than... There's Bomberman 1, 2, and Generations? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Which came first? I don't know. Probably Generations came first. And then there's Paper Mario. Good old Paper Which Mario. Which is a good game. Yeah, I, I, fun game. This is one of the games I actually beat myself. I actually did not like that game, and I'll tell you why. I don't like games where you don't actually physically battle. I have to, yeah. I have to agree. I didn't like it either. Yeah. I played it, but I didn't like. I like the idea. My wife liked it. Yeah, she uh, put some more time playing it than I did. It very much it reminded me of Pokemon, the way that they did the battles, and I just didn't like it. You know, I was like, no, I don't want you to tell me what battle damage I did. I want to like fucking wail and do the battle damage myself. All right, so now that we do this, let me do one more thing, and then I'll sit down and. and AJ, you sit in the back over there. Well, I've got something that this. In case people were paying attention to what was going on last week, there was some drama because uh, son of video gamer Daryl could not play uh, his uh, oh, Xbox man. One. So we're, we're, I said I would go online. Yeah, how are we gonna do that? We well, we get Chris to do it. Yeah, I appreciate you buying that. Yeah, no big deal, dude. He still needs Ethernet cable to go to it. No, no, you said he has it. No, he doesn't have the cable. I don't need the cable. Well, I'm sure I have one somewhere. But Wait a minute, there's a cable right here. Yeah, it's, it does have a cable. Look. A secondary cable? Yeah, cable? it plugs in there, and then that's a splitter. No, I know, but a cable from the system to this. Well, doesn't, doesn't, uh, doesn't Chris already use it? No. It, no, there's no cable coming oh, from Oh, cable to come from I there to the uh, cable. All right. All right, I I thought you didn't need it. Well, yeah. the drama continues, folks. Uh, Nick was all like, "Oh, I'll never get it. I'll never be able yeah, to play Yeah, thank you so much. Maybe you can find a cable for me. You might have a little one. Home I'll find one. one. I'll find one. Or or AJ has one. I'm sure we have one. All right, now I'm gonna turn this off and I'm gonna sit like down. Like a three like a three feet a three foot cable. Yeah, three okay. foot and a definite. Cable. I may get longer, you know, yeah. um, but I'll find you one for sure. Or or uh, AJ will find one. We'll probably find one at the flea market, maybe this weekend. So okay, I'm gonna turn this off. And I'm going to sit There's down. There's no way he's going to hook it up without that three-foot cable. He's just going to be pitching. Yeah. I'm surprised you don't have one. There's probably in those drawers in there, but I can't get in there. No, no, I know. All right. No, it's stuff. I got a master system here with all the hookups. 
All right, let me just That's eventually gonna check go the camera one more time. That master system here is going to go to you, too. It's got old hookups. You know what I got? Um, a a yep. Sega CD model. We're recording. On top of, with the and everybody should be nicely work. in frame. Yeah, I can probably even tighten this up a little bit. That's going to go to you, too. We're going to have to dig that stuff out. When okay, tighten our, it up a little bit. On, on our different days, you guys told me we're going to dig Everybody's well lit. Up, you know? I got Japanese PlayStation 2 in there with, 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 with Res. What's that game? The one that you sing into? Res, right? Res. Yeah, I got the Japanese version. Is it spelled R Y R E Z? Oh, R E Z. A Japanese copy of that with the with the there's a, this microphone thing. It's, it's in the box, mint. Nice. If that's something you're selling the store, it'll go to you. You let me know. Yeah, we pretty much sell anything in the store. Japanese right PS2 is going to be for sale too. I paid one hundred thirty dollars for it. We're gonna the store. We're gonna talk about the store a little bit today. We're gonna talk about what it's like. One of the topics that we cover. Will be what it's I like. A, I have a PlayStation there that has the, the door in it that you can swap the games. Do the swap trick. Yeah. Yeah. So that'll go, that that'll go to you guys too. All right. One of the things we're, we're going to talk about today is uh, just the store. About what it's like to actually open the store, and how difficult, how expensive, and, and how complicated it's been. Question: What are you paying for a month for rent? Uh, we're only paying nine twenty-five, which is actually. Pretty damn cheap split in our opinion. Three? What's yeah. all the trilogy? We're gonna split it. We don't know how much it'll be yet, but we assume it'll be like between one and two hundred. Yeah, yeah, but then then you the down payment three hundred. Yeah, I I mean if you start off, you go oh nine twenty five. Are you gonna put an alarm system in? Yeah. yeah. Yes, criminals. We're gonna put in an alarm system. So and don't and twenty four hour cameras. That's right. So don't even try. Don't even think that you're gonna be like because uh, I, if I said no, we're not gonna put an alarm. I mean. Yes, we are going to put in an alarm. I don't do that. Um, but yeah, it's just, we said 925. You go, oh, 925. That isn't bad split three ways. But actually, it was we needed about four times 925, right? Mm -hmm. Why? And then another three. You guys put all uh, First, yeah. security, last, and then a broker. So straight out, for a $925 store, straight out, we needed, we had to cut a check for almost 4000 yep. Yeah. And... Um, that's a big bite, folks. That's a lot of money, you know. Wow. Uh, yeah, I, I think we had it. Where did right? I get the $4,000? Uh, it's not like sell a lot of drugs, and, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I do some pimping. <laughs> no, you know, it, it's like split the way that we split it. It's much easier, you know. I mean, AJ, Steve could have done it on their own, but it's a lot of money to lay out. We've cut, I mean, we've made the risk so low. Here. Yeah. Yeah. What is that? It's the slot machine. Now, why did you want that that much? What do you play it on? Just a Game Boy or? Yeah, that's for the pocket. Oh, it's for the pocket. You don't see box games for this thing much. Hell no. So probably buying it from Japan was a lot cheaper than buying it from here. You see games uh, shipped on eBay it's from simple, Japan all the time. But it plays on any system. It's region free. I think the system is region free. You keeping this right? Mm -hmm. And you display it with your uh, with your pocket. But um, yeah. So. The first thing that we had to do in order to, besides like looking around I'm and finding, I'm also going to eventually say that Sonic Bank is yeah. just as very rare. You got to see if you can find some kind of price on it because it's very rare. What is what's the Sonic Bank? That Sonic because I know how much you like Sonic. Yeah, I know. But it's what very is, rare, is it? Man. Just a bank? Find that thing, man. Is it ceramic? Is it plastic? Plastic. Huh. I can't find it. Well, I'm sure. I have that. Found it. Uh, <laughs> you don't. Need, you don't want to know. Here, wait. Let me, let me, uh, what, what, it's, uh, it's not that much. It's this, right? Um, yeah. Wait a minute. Don't, don't get oh, rid of it. I just want to add this. 699. Oh, wow. All right. Okay. So, so, uh, well, Harrow has a very, very rare. It was very rare when I got yeah. it. It was very, very rare. Very rare Sonic it's not bank stuff. that he would like to sell to Well, agent. take it, take it today. It's okay, man. Just take it as a gift. Well, it's $6.99 or six hundred ninety nine. dollars 99 That thing was worth Show it. That thing right there was worth $200 two years ago. Let's see sold. That just listed. That thing was worth a few hundred dollars uh, a couple yeah, years ago. Fifteen. And people weren't. Twenty-four. They were, they were being scummy back then. Oh 16, yeah. Sixteen. You know? Yeah. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna outtakes and close-ups. I'm gonna do on secondhand oh, Daisy. Ten dollars. What do you mean ten dollars? It's sold for ten dollars. But someone has it priced at seven hundred. No. 
They six, had them. Six dollars ninety nine. Oh, I thought you said six hundred ninety nine. They used to have this thing up for over hundred bucks when I got when I first got it. Why would it drop and so I just, low? It, I just did not sell it back then. Yeah. I probably should have been well, selling back used then. Well, everything used to be early. Yeah, I guess you should. Do have. You, oh, Daryl, do you have like anything to like here. lease out to us when it comes to like? Oh, we're talking shop. Okay, I'm talking shop. See, like you, you had said yeah. to me that you want to buy an arcade machine. The problem is, in order to get one of these arcade machines out of here, it's virtually impossible. I would do tabletop. It's virtually impossible. I think those tabletops are amazing. I mean, you know, uh, uh, it all depends on if you want to do where people pay. It's like I'm eventually going to sell you a kiosk. That's that's for sure. I'll give you an agreement on that. I'm eventually going to sell you that. Once I can just get around a little bit, because I'm never going to play again, no matter what. I just can't really... Dreamcast kiosk. I really oh. can't really... Tell you how to get it out of here. I can tell you how to take it apart. Oh, what the what Dreamcast kiosk? It comes at the top as well. No, yeah. no, no. I know, no. I I know how to get that out of there because I used to have the top piece, so I know it's it's light. It's light. I carried that thing from too many games onto the car by myself. Wow. Well, I went to PA for that. I had bought one too many games. Yeah, he's in PA, right? Yeah, oh, I sold one. And I sold it. It was just the top piece. So that that we can get out and like. Five ten minutes. You gotta find a price for me on that because it's got the sports dream gas in it, and and you gotta um, find the bottom If you if you have piece. something that we could get you some coinage too, like if there's a machine that we can put in that that is like you said a slot machine, we could collect the coins and give it but to Darryl, you. I, I can tell you from from experience when I sold my just for the top piece, I sold a top piece, and I got about two two hundred for the top piece. And the base on the bottom. The base I have the base. I'll tell you right now. Hold on, we're, 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 we're playing how to price a kiosk. Yeah. Um, but getting back to the store. <laughs> uh, and I know we were just oh, talking Darryl, about... Oh, Daryl, guess what? I have for that. I would, I would actually give you your um, thing back. Your system back. You want to know why? It's, 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 it's plugged in there, man. Why? Because you got the... I, I have the kiosk one. Oh, yeah. I have the kiosk one. Oh, that's cool. Well, that would be something you'd sell in the store, that system. No, I'd probably put it in the... In the Kiosk, just to put in the yeah, store. I mean the, the the black one. Yeah, nah, I wouldn't do that to you. I'll, I'll let you get it. Because I don't need it, because I got Dreamcast in there. Yeah. That's something else if you got any Dreamcast. Cause I have uh, work and what Dreamcast. it, the system that's in the kiosk, that comes to the kiosk, is it different looking? That's a sports system. I have the box version. Oh, it. so the black, okay, so the black sports ones I have gotten occasionally. Because I like I actually sold one of those to, uh. I like the way it looks in there, the black one. Steve. Yeah, I actually think I sold the sports one to Steve, right? Yeah, the black yeah. one. Yeah. Um, or traded, but uh, so that's the sports one was the one that went in the kiosk. Mm -hmm. I bought that brand new. Oh, it didn't. No, it doesn't go in the kiosk. What goes in the kiosk? kiosk? What does the kiosk Dreamcast look like? Um, a regular. It's white, it's white with a special adapter on the back, broadband, a ah. block adapter. I have the adapter in a Japanese. I have a Japanese Dreamcast, Dreamcast in the in the back wall. Uh -huh. It has a special adapter for the kiosk on it. Uh, one day we'll show this up. Yeah, look it up. So you don't get all I internet. think the kiosk, the value, it's about four to five hundred. Yeah, that's somewhere we'll be talking yeah. about. Yeah, four to five hundred for sure. Because that's what I see from online. Mm -hmm. I mean, honestly, I'll be honest with you. If you guys think that you can bring me five hundred dollars for it next time, you can take it. If you think you can handle that, if you want to buy that five hundred dollars, I will sell it to you. If you want to do something like that, just do me a favor. Bring cash. Because... When I when it's We're not talking cash, money, folks. When it's not cash, then I can't do anything with the money myself. Yeah, yeah, cash, yeah. I can give. It, look, take this, do this, yeah, do yeah, this. Yeah. When it's when it's PayPal, I, she has to go on a computer and try to transfer it to the bank. You can't do PayPal from your phone. No. Oh. So then she's got to transfer it to her bank. Then I really don't have any any money going into PayPal, it. right? Okay. I don't have any control over it. I made a hundred some dollars from YouTube. I just got AdSense. Oh, nice. It was over a hundred bucks. Did you get but, another payment from it? But it's going to her. Sure. See, and I don't have any control. Here's over something it. you don't know, you may not know about YouTube. Sometimes you can actually make some money off it. Uh, I, I can't. Well, they changed things. You, it, they made it much harder. There was this little glorious moment when YouTube was let everybody earn money off their videos, and and everybody had an equal yeah, and fair shot. Yeah, you want to buy it for cash from me, I'll sell it to you five hundred dollars. That's fine. Yeah. That, that's fine. I'll do it because the cash helps me because we're gonna go away. We're supposed to go away Where to you AC going? or something. If if I get to go to AC because I have so many oh, problems. Oh, nice. I got so many problems. Well, I'm sure that they're used to people who have physical disabilities. No, at I got AC. problems with my um, bowels. Yeah. So we had a lot of problems. My wife says she wasn't taking me. So. 
you know. Well, we'll see what happens. You don't know. I don't know. Yeah, Sometimes gotta, it'd still be gotta, nice. I still nice gotta hope that it happens. You know. I still got summer coming up. I'm gonna go, go, to go to the, I'm supposed to go to track Saturday. Go see my friends at the track. Oh, are you cool? cool. And. Daryl, uh, video gamer Daryl was also a racer of mini bikes and other dirt bikes. Uh, he was doing that uh, up till last year, right? I, yeah, yeah. I haven't seen these people in a long time. Two of them came. One of them came to the hospital. Nice, the hospital. good friends. And it's kind of weird me going back down here to see my friends down there. You so probably I, have a great it, day though. You know, it's like I'm gonna see all these bikes going around and racing. It's it's a show race, so they're gonna be very busy. So I probably won't be able to talk to anybody. Kids aren't really into for racing. Me, anymore, for me, for me, it's just really I'm going for the ride. To get sure. out, you know. Yeah, getting out of the house is a big deal. It's not only complicated because you live in a walk up. Yep. And it's a steep walk up. It's a long three hour drive, so I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to a three hour drive. Sure, roll the window down, stick your head out the window. You know, so, where are you, so um, where are you doing Sunday? Well, I, I think we want to talk about this weekend, it'll be a street fair. Uh, that AJ and I. I yeah, except May AJ's not going to do it, right? I thought it was May Memorial. No, nah, it's Maywood. Maywood Street Maywood. Fair. Usually that one's pretty good, but my stock is all weird right now because uh sales have just started happening so i have a lot of the same old crap i had last year of course whatever i bring there will be fresh <clears throat> it's just not good stuff it's just leftover you know and what about saturday just shopping no i go shopping you know he's gonna probably do the metal ends really uh, yeah he was thinking of doing there's a geek uh fest, yeah, geek fest on this weekend and aj had thought about doing it but i mean he could do it he has the stock i don't so i'm like i'm not gonna go there with the stupid games and cds i have you know, and DVDs. I, if I'm going to go somewhere, I'm to make money. Already, you know? Yeah, and he paid for the Metal Lens. Uh, if you don't know anything about the Metal Lens flea market, you already prepaid for that? Yeah, he took the monthly. And that's why I got screwed this month. He got screwed. That's the thing about the Metal Lens. If you're considering doing the Metal Lens flea market uh, and you consider doing the monthly, if it rains, you know, tough. Uh, Did it rain last week? Tea, so. um, it rained last week and the week before. And the week before. So uh, we just had like a bunch of weeks where just nothing. There was no chance to make money. I haven't done it. I did the, okay, out of this month, the three weeks, I did one flea market. I did the street fair, but I did a very light setup. It barely made any money. And uh, this week, I don't know. It's, it, you're already saying it might rain on Sunday, right? Yeah. Yeah, I saw the possibility of a shower. Yeah, man. You, then you're at a street fair. You're all set up. I don't know. Just I'm waiting for my tax return. <laughs> I get Are you still going to do it if it's going to rain? I will go because uh, they will need Marie to help. And then they might need me to help. I, uh, I helped at the street fair last time, uh, and, you know, they, if you help, they pay you. So, um, usually you can trade for spaces or something like that. So, you know, it was... Um, Take your mic set up? It depends on how bad the rain is. I set up last Sunday, and they said it was going to rain. But then they said, oh, it's not going to rain, it's going to rain, it's not going to rain, it's going to rain, it's not going to rain, it's going to rain. So, what, what, what wound up happening was... It didn't rain till later in the day, but I did kind of get rained on, uh, but I was very well prepared for it. Um, I did a very light setup. That's why I made barely any money. I didn't put anything too good out. I just put out stuff I didn't care about and just, you know. You still sell records? I will sell records. Yeah, I have some records. Uh, he's even uh, messing with records, too. Really? You're gonna put record? Are you going to put records in the store? Yeah, no. we're definitely going to put records in the store. I got a whole bin store. of records, man. Good, valuable records. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Well, the bottom bin is all records. Maybe that's something we'll do together. Yeah. I don't know. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do records. Have they all been priced out. Steve, all of us actually will sell records, so we'll probably make. They're at a least twenty store. bucks a piece for the record. Oh, nice. Oh, is that, wanna, is that stuff that I was? I want to. I want to get to the 3DO games only because some of them are they his. I bought them from him. You bought them from him, right? Yeah, a while ago. Okay. Oh. Um. Yeah, so we'll have rec records in the that, store. When I bought that 3DO. I needed the games, so I bought them from him, and I played them, but they're still mint. And I bought some loose games. Yeah. There's some loose games. Well, I think there's good cases. Whose beep beep was that? That's All right, let me just make sure it's still running. Sometimes it does that. Yeah. I think every 26 minutes, it goes, it goes beep beep. And it goes on. It just stops and immediately starts recording again. I like this camera. Uh, this is an Akaso something pro. Uh, I paid 110 bucks for it. And... Uh, it's pretty good, Not you know. Bad, it, it even has like a image stabilizer built in. I might get if we do podcasts like like a bigger podcast. If we do it in the shop, I might get several of these because you can walk around and it's not like all you know. When you walk with a camera, it's like 
you know, you got the walking motion. But this kind of stabilizes it so it's a lot more smooth. I even took it into the um, antique showcase and I walked like really quick, briskly up and down the aisle and it came out really smooth. Um, One of our future podcasts we're going to have is a challenge between you and AJ playing the driving game. Who drives yeah, 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 we'll do that. We'll put the camera back there. I, I think AJ so will probably get the that. screen. AJ drives point. way more than me. <laughs> I just like smash. Well, I was challenged to see who plays the. I card. warm up and get and get a little better at that. Who doesn't stuff, smash the game? Who doesn't smash the wall? Uh, I I the probably can see that AJ will probably win, but I'll play anyway. I don't care. You know, I don't care if I win or lose or whatever. I'm in. I'm in it for the fun of the game. Um. So we were talking about like how difficult it is. What we do is we take this and we slide it over there and over the camera. Either back there facing it. If I get a couple of cameras, I'll like edit the film together. Yeah, we you know, put one here facing that way. All right, one back. There I just, I, I gotta get some money to together. Get you know? screen, to get the screen. I sold something today for like three hundred bucks. Wow, oh, nice sell. So, yeah, let me see if I can find it. But uh, I don't know if I can find it. Let's see if I can. You know what? I'm not gonna look for it now. It's like too annoying. I guess you got probably got really cheap more beans to me, right? And you're gonna know. I, you know what? I think I got it pretty cheap. And I think the 300 I made was obviously way more than I paid. This is probably something like uh, one, was the glass. things that I you sold. Something that was glass. Nope, not this time. No. It was an actual piece of artwork. Um, <clears throat> well, I've always done the best. I've always done on eBay with items that I sell have been mostly art and then jewelry. And God that, bless you for, and perfume. For, for, for shipping art, man. That box you got to prep for that? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I don't Even think this one's I that big. Even I would didn't want to ship anything big like that, man. But I just sold a piece of artwork for 300 bucks. That yeah. box size, my God. How yeah. do you go? You go to full talk? If AJ would carry the conversation a minute, I would look at it and, and show it. Because I want to look and show you guys what I Because even when, like, some of the big items that I have now, I was going to, I had, when, before I got sick, yeah. before I had my show, and I was going to take them to the UPS store and have them pack the stuff because yeah. it was so big. When summer comes... Then they ship right there. They hold on to it. Yeah, they do. They you just know? charge more, you know. Um, <clears throat> when summer comes, you'll have uh, Chris. And you could teach him the business. I want to, but I think he's going to get a job because I think it's too cheap for him. He's, he's into much more money. Man, I'll him. tell you something. He's gonna, He thinks he's going to make more money getting a job, right? But... No. I don't think he wants to be bound to this place. Well, I mean, that's okay. Daisy went through the same thing, and she's still my daughter, and she just she now she finally found a job because my brother-in-law can get a shoe, get him into shop right. It's shoeing. All right. I mean, what and what's minimum there? Like, uh, what is your middle? Is it ten? Or he probably will make. I don't know. I'm not into making minimum me. wage. <laughs> I don't know what it is. But in New Jersey, I think it's like ten bucks or eight dollars or something. Like I that. had I, I asked him if he wanted to do eBay with me, if he would do it for me, and he would take the stuff to the post office. But he says, my wife says she's most likely he's going to be getting you know an outside job because she wants him to start paying for some stuff around here. All right. I don't think eBay will be enough for him to be profitable with. Yeah. Well, for himself. Unless what about it, Nick? Nick uh, and unless he had all his, unless he had everything. Yeah. Nick can't type, man. Yeah, but you can you can type even if you type one key at a Chris time. Chris, remember I still need somebody to go to the post office. That's my problem. Yeah, how I still now? need. He's still young, right? I still need somebody to get the stuff and box it up for me, tape it up. And well, I think and Nick can handle it. everything all the way up to like physically get out and go to the post office because he's is he twelve or thirteen? He's, t- he's eleven. Oh, 11. He's, he's so taller, I'm stuck I there. Until I get better, I can't do eBay until I get better. I don't yeah, think I'm okay. going to be doing any eBay anytime soon, either eBay with them, even in the summertime. Because all they want to do is play Even video. when you're healthy, everybody, eBay sucks. <laughs> I don't even like doing eBay. eBay. They just want to play video games. They don't want to be involved. It's their childhood. They don't, don't want to ruin their childhood. Game, man. You know? It's like, that's that's the one thing, like, in this day and age, my honest blessing is you guys coming and buying stuff from me. That's yeah. my blessing. That's well, you know what, Daryl? You got a lot of stuff. Anybody would come and buy. But I got stock. I got books. You have to worry about what they're going to pay for. Yeah. I mean, I got all of them on top of that closet up here. So the box systems, you know, that yeah. you sell the store. I mean, it's all got. It's all going to eventually go all to you guys. Okay. To be honest with you, the Nintendo system, the deluxe Nintendo system up there. I got the box Halo system. That's all you're about. You know. Yeah, it'll be perfect. It's eventually all going to go to you guys. Samba, the shop got, will look like real nice. The Samba Amigo thing in there. I forget what that's called, the drum set thing. But then I got um, a lot of uh, the Donkey Kong drum sets in the box. With, with the, the games? With the games, yeah. Okay, that's better. With the games they sell, without the game. Because yeah. I have, I've been toting around a, a Donkey Kong drum set for like months and months and months. 
And without the game, they, you got the game? You got it in the box. Yeah. Not just the drum set. I have the, the box and the drum set. I just don't have the game. I got a drum set still sitting in the, in the hallway that when we go for the Pokemon cards in here, we're going to get that out too. It's in the box. God boy, Carmelo. You know what? I got that thing that I want. would like for you guys to sell at the store. When you go down the stairs, take a uh, look through the bars of the of the, um, of the uh, railing. It's the thing that you put on your chest and it, and it hits you. It's a brand new in the box. It's still sealed. That thing does a good, uh, like a, uh, item. that's a store kind of item, you know? Well, I think between the three of us, we're going to have a lot of beautiful stuff in that store. And, and that includes Steve and even you, Daryl. You know, there's going to be, the store's going to be real nice. We're going to keep it neat. I want to keep some really quality you items. Your mom's going to come clean it. <laughs> your mom. <laughs> oh. He says his mom's going to come clean it. Oh, yeah? She yeah. said already. She told you. Let me see. I'm going to see if I can find this thing. So, um, what are you going to pay your mom? As little as possible? Yep. How can you pay her nothing? She's your mom. So? What, do you give her a hug? Yeah. <laughs> See, that Neo, Neo Geo over hug. there, that Neo Geo over there, eventually they're probably going to sell that to you eventually. Because that would be, I think, good for your house. Yeah. Or in the store. It's a coin, and you could change it to coin if you learn how to do it. Is it uncomplicated to do, or yeah, like a change YouTube video? Settings. You have to change the settings. So if you went on a Facebook group, they tell you exactly how to do it. I just can't get to it to do it. I couldn't be able to. I might be able to get to the settings if we turn. I'm not it on. used to going into my. Before you would take it out of here, I think I could get a setting to change this coin in for you. I just. I'm gonna see if I can find the thing that I sold, so I can show selling. The board in there is probably worth just as much as a machine. It's got. A, it's got the special smaller board slot board in it. I just to, to if I could show all the stuff that uh. Daryl uh, sold. Okay, I got it. Uh, if I can show all the stuff that... Uh... Oh, here it is. Yeah, it's funny. I sold this. Oh, and now I remember it. <laughs> there it is, right on top. See it? Yeah. I'll show this I'll show this on the camera. So you can see. Uh, I'm going to ship that. It's not that big. It's like this big, I think. So wait, it's not a problem. Wait, was this a real picture of it? It's a painting. This is what this guy does. I'll show everybody in a second. This is... Yeah, why don't you take a picture of it? What do you mean, take a picture? It's over, That's what's sold. Yeah, but it's over a white background you had. Oh yeah, I think I took a picture outside. Um, if you here's something helpful to people who need to take pictures for eBay, uh, the best lighting in the world is almost always sunlight. sunlight. Yeah, just go yeah. outside. Um, if you if you can get like one of them dollar store white cards, if it's a small item, put it down. If you want another dollar store white card, if the sun's coming this way. You fill in the light, so the shadow gets filled in a little, it's not that dense. Uh, you don't get that graduation where it goes from light to dark from one side to the other. Fills in a little bit. So you go outside, sun's coming this way, and I usually like to kind of side light That's things. what I started to do. Yeah. Pictures came out really nice. Oh, beautiful, yeah. because all your cameras all your cameras are meant to read sunlight. They This light inside here, it's not good. So that's why a lot of times people take like the worst crummy photos. But if you just want... free shipping on it? God damn it. But it's 300 bucks, dude. Even if it cost me like... Uh, Thirty bucks to ship, you know. Like, what do I care? Where, where, where are you going? Post office. It's not that big. I go, no, I'll go to post office. It's not that big. Here, all right. Let me show. Where, where is it? Okay. What did you do to make me not find this? Let me do this. All right. Here it is. Okay. How come? Where are my pictures? What did you do? It is messing up my technologies. Okay. Thank you. All right. Let me see. Okay, I sold this. Yeah, <laughs> I sold this for three hundred dollars. It's a a painting by this and dude named. He got it cheap, and he, and he made a lot of money. I think I, I I tell you, if I paid twenty bucks for it, you know, and I don't think I paid twenty bucks for it. But this is uh, this is a sign Harry Glaubach, Glaubach, uh Brooklyn Dodgers Ebbets Field baseball painting on wood. This is what this guy does. And I figured I would sell it because it's the Brooklyn Dodgers, a team that no longer exists. You know, you just have to wait to find a fan. And here, here's some more pictures. And what this guy does, that's a close-up. He, he, it's kind of like um, an assemblage or like a collage, right? He cuts out the wood and he paints it, right? Uh, the features on it. And then he glues it onto the board. And then, uh, uh, here's another one. Uh, and uh, there's a close-up of the, the field. 
And that's just the kind of stuff that you can sell on eBay and so make really good money. I don't even know how, yeah, obviously. I don't even know how long I had it, but that's what I say about eBay. I'm going to be posting a, a sold video later today of items that I sold, which will probably come out before this video comes out. But that's what I say about eBay. It's like when you do, when you put stuff on eBay, the, the best thing that can happen is it sells very quickly. And you get your price. Yeah, we've had some really good sales on eBay. Like with those, oh, dude. Remember those toucan lamps? Yeah. Uh, the ones that you found? No. Oh, no, the toucan ones. Yeah, I said, Daryl, yeah, you want to listen? We made at least 800 bucks on those. I used to tell my... I, I used to find stuff. But because I have a lot of stuff to list, Daryl's my good friend. And I wanted to give him stuff because you're a stay-at-home dad. Yeah, right? that, that, they didn't have the bulbs when I went and I got the bulbs special. You went and got the bulbs special. But every once in a while, I would I wanted to give you something that where you well, were like, like holy crap, bucks. I made hundreds of dollars. They were like fifty bucks each for the bulbs. No, oh, yeah, but it was wow, worth it. They're special bulbs, yeah, it was worth it. You know, I I didn't like make money back on the bulbs, but we well, should have deducted. It was, it I said was, deduct everything. It was right? included in the sale, or whatever. They, the people got two. Actually, I gave them two extra bulbs. I bought more right, just in case they got messed up in the shipping. I would have packed them separate, you know, but you know. I bought four bulbs for it just in case they went bad. And that's the thing about eBay. Every time I find something really good, I never find it again. <laughs> yeah. See, it's like now, I just sold this painting. Do you think I will ever find another Harry Glauback painting again in my life? Probably not. I mean, if I see I it, I don't know. Much about lamps from you. That's when I went yeah. to the side of the house and I found a spaghetti lamp. They're so, oh, yeah. They were garbage. I, I sold them for a couple hundred dollars. My friend Daryl says to me, hey, I saw these lamps. They're in the garbage over there. And... Uh, he showed me the picture, and I don't know if you know when I say spaghetti plastic lamps, what, what they are. But they were spaghetti lamps, and they were what? Just the domes, right? Yeah. So I said, Daryl, run back and get them, <laughs> right? And he was like, why are they good? I'm just, I said, just drop everything. Run back and get them now. So you did. You ran back and you got them. And I was really being I was scummy on them because I got them for free. Free up the garbage, folks. And I, and I made money on so I was scummy. But what did you sell them for? You had three of them. $200. Did yeah. you sell them individually or together? I think they were at least uh, 125 a piece. And you sold them individually, yeah. right? Yeah. Which is what I told them to do because otherwise, you know, they're, they're very big. I had the whole lamp, but it was huge. Oh, you did? It was 70s lamp. Well, lamp. honestly, the shades are worth probably more yeah, than the lamp. Than the lamp but if, in a store, a setup like that, like if we ever find something like that and we put it in our store, we could probably ask like six, seven hundred dollars yes. or something like that. You know. When I priced um, the whole lamp, it was very expensive. I have some lamps I said, in my well, house. What am I gonna do with this big lamp? I'm yeah. like, it's gonna be a real pain in the neck to ship that. I think in a, in the store, I will put it's some. Better item for somebody to come in and pick up himself. Yeah, know? I agree, hundred percent. We actually had uh, the stupid Longaburger. Did I tell you the Longaburger baskets? No. So I got a sale. If you check my videos, I might have put Longaburger in the title, but I bought this insane grouping of longer burger baskets for like 30 bucks 25 30 something like that so somebody made me an offer yesterday on facebook we had them for 200 i'll give you 125. you have them on like, facebook what do you got you selling on marketplace i'm trying i still haven't sold anything on facebook marketplace everybody you know I have, it's hard it's not easy and i put stuff up and it's like i don't really need facebook marketplace but i figured i'd try it with certain things and i tried it with about 10 things so far and I guess all they want is video games, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't know what else. Maybe cars, stuff like that. Um, so anyway, someone offered me 125 on, I would say $400 worth of baskets, which is fine. I don't care, you know? Um, one of the baskets alone is worth 75 to to $100, right? So I'm like, 150 we got a deal, right? But then it becomes a complication. They, do me, they wanted to pay me through Facebook. I'm like, nope, I want cash. Yeah, you I don't want to pay you that way. I don't know. Hey, I don't care. I want cash. They're like, well, I don't know. I'm like, okay, deal's off. No problem. I don't know how that works. But screw them. I, I'll see, sell the, them I see this icon come up to pay somebody. I'm like, what am I paying for? I don't well, want to you know, that as it is, I understand why people do it. I, and I understand, like, meeting people you here. and then meet them and stuff. Why as well get yeah, you got to meet them, run around, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And, um, cash. yeah, so it's like, what? Now you're going to electronically pay me and then pull some kind of scam later on? Nope. I got cash. Done deal. It's like, I know... You're happy because you walked away and you took the item. Um, if I'm taking electronic, then it's complications, right? So they wanted to pay me through Facebook. You must have done it. All the time. Yeah, but they, they're not really even paying PayPal. They're paying through Facebook or something. Mm -hmm. Where's the money come from when you hooked up? Probably Facebook. They get a share? Mm -hmm. Oh, so now now I'm not even selling it for 100 what, What's Yeah, but how do you put the money on Facebook? How do you Probably do credit card. Yeah. Oh. Okay. What percentage does Facebook take? Like part. part. Like 5%? Yeah. 
Yeah. So now I'm not even making the 150 bucks. Now I'm down like uh, seven dollars and fifty cents. So, <clears throat> and it's always like, I personally feel it's not always going to be your way. You know, you want it from me. I got it to sell to you. And if you're not willing to bend, well, guess what? I don't have to sell it to you. You know. So the lady was like, "Well, it's both of them." I'm like, "I don't care. Deal's off." You know. And what I will do is I will sell them individually. I was already frustrated with them. I will probably sell them if we go to an antique show. I might save them for the weather for street fair. Don't know. Don't care. The price I was selling them at was a, a generous gift to this person, and they were messing with me. We, I've had other stuff. Like I had something. Um, I had a spice rack on. I put it for three hundred dollars. Right? I wanted two hundred. Immediately, I get like a crummy offer for a hundred twenty or something, and I'm like, nope. Did it have any spices it. in it? I actually went online and I bought a special spice bottle because it was a short one. I paid. I bought the whole rack. It's a. It's a, I can't remember. It's like dense, but it's not. It's something else. Uh, it's a really cool. It's a spice rack that you mount on your wall, and then it's like a ship's wheel. You rotate it. And then the, the spice that spice you want, there, yeah, yeah, just, you unscrew it and you, and, and you open the jar and you take the spice out. Um, so anyway, I paid like 30 bucks for the spice rack and then it was short a jar and I was lucky. I was like, oh, I'm just going to go online and see if I can find a jar. I was lucky enough to go online and find a jar and I paid almost 30 bucks for the, the one jar. Did you buy it at a garage sale or a metal one? I bought it at an estate sale. Oh. Um, and <clears throat> I could flip it right away. For about, I think 150 I might put it in the store. It's pretty cool. I don't know. But if I put anything in the store, it's going to be like high-end and uh, kind of mid-century modern. I like mid-century modern. That's kind of what I grew up uh, in. Like funky 70s. I like funky 70s stuff. I like bright funky colorful. Funky 70s. I like that. That's, I like that. Yeah, I like funky 70s stuff. That's, that's just a funny thing to say. Funky 70s. Yeah. But then you're limiting yourself only to the, the 70s. So if you only want to do 70s, Funky 70s is a great name. Now you didn't fully go to the Xbox <coughs> games again, right? You, you still have to do them, right? Yeah, you, could, you yeah. want to save stuff for yeah. next week? Yes, too. You know? It's up to you save guys. A little... Come early and we'll go through a lot of yeah, stuff. Yeah, I think that's how we're going to do it. We'll come earlier. AJ and I will go through stuff. And if, we, if there's stuff we want to take, uh, we'll make the pile. And then we'll show what you were willing to give up. I mean, and, you know. I mean before I leave, I'll look at the PS2 games on the phone. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Xbox games on yeah. They're easy to get to, they're right there. I, I, today, AJ's on a time schedule, I believe. I'm not on a time schedule. Oh, you're not? Okay. Okay, so you are? You might be on a time schedule. No, I'm not on a time schedule. I don't think we're going to record all the way to four, because this will run up, but then we'll just we'll just hang out, like, you know, and we'll, we'll have our own private conversations, you know. Right? We'll talk about stuff that's non- uh, scummy reseller, um, secondhand Shit, Daisy. Man, I, I, you guys stay here all damn day, man, because it's like I'm by my damn self. Yeah, you know, it's hard. It really is hard, dude. I, I, it's like we yeah. all got to work and stuff. Yeah. Like, I wish we could hang out, like, even more. Like, maybe we'll figure something out, you know. Laura wants to get you out sometimes, get you to the store, hang out, you know. Like, you gonna? Be, uh, do you think you'll be there for the opening? I don't know. I was asking her to see if she had off that day, but it's tough, man. I yeah. want to come. Of uh, course, you know that if I was able to get there, you know I would be there. You'd be there every day, I think. Yep, I You'd would. You'd be like, can I bike there? <laughs> yep. No, actually, you you were driving the car, but you only, you only have one car, can right? Can those games? Yeah. yeah. I would take the car and go there and just hang while she was in her job. I'd be there all day with you. Yeah. I mean, you could always take an Uber. If, uh, if I mean, that's what you could have done very easily, you know. Yeah. Now, it's obviously more complicated. You know, the one thing I don't like about this camera, though, is it doesn't have a light in the front. So, so I can't tell what it's doing without go, stepping around and, and making sure. I'm gonna just want to make sure it's still recording. I don't want you guys to miss any of this super entertaining, uh, yeah, gibberish. And, and, and did we have any topics? Did you make any yeah, topics? Well, we're gonna talk about like the store because it turns out that opening a store is really hard and expensive. It's both hard and expensive. Um, yeah. But then there's all the, the stuff that you have to do before you even, like, find a, he's finding a store, right? That took, like, what, yeah, months? So, so you can get ratings on your store and stuff, like Yelp ratings. And stuff. <laughs> Don't even so say, say that stuff. Like, you're expecting to get some of the, some of the stinkers out there to probably yeah, yeah. get bad ratings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was like. You want to bring that up. Uh, oh, you know what? Let me, before I say anything about anything else, 
Uh, we have a Facebook page. And that's now. only if they actually watch these videos. Uh, they probably don't know nothing about these. Well, videos. my friend, people that like us would obviously give give us a uh, nice rating. I mean, but I want to mention the Facebook. People that are, are against you will don't never see these videos, so they don't even know. AJ has enemies. They'll, they'll <laughs> probably look you up from posts on Facebook and seeing the, oh, uh, seeing the name of Steve the Steve gets along with everybody, right? No? All right. People look at me. Uh, oh, well. Well, I, I guess I'll be the face. <laughs> I'll be there. You can put me up and it goes, this guy looks nice. That's why we need cameras. He's Steve says he was active. What, are they coming in and stealing? Stuff? No, trash the store. Uh, right. Say that they were there doing something that we have proof that they never came into the store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But how can you prove they never came into the store? Because it shows their faces. These people are stupid. No, but you can't prove they never came into the store unless you show all the video footage you have from ever. History. Which we could. Which is yeah, really who's going to watch that? I would. No, you wouldn't. Don't lie. To a you would fall asleep would. immediately. What? To, to, to remove a nasty review, I would. Uh, if they give nasty, uh, I don't. I don't care about Yelp reviews. They can go to hell. They they already threatened me with. with uh, Just keep. Reviews. Okay, everybody that's dumb enough to th to to make claims about how you're going to trash the store and stuff like that, we're 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 what are you? We're uh, screenshotting all those stupid idiot threats. So we'll have them <laughs> in case you're dumb enough to do it, and we'll probably get you kicked off or whatever Facebook, Yelp, or whatever you know. Just for saying stupid crap like that. Whatever you can do. Uh, so anyway, what I wanted to say is that we have a Facebook page for the store. How many likes do we have? Over a hundred. Yeah, because my wife sent it to over a thousand people. Yeah. Do I get the Pac-Man game? No, no, no. You, you didn't win with somebody else. Ah. Somebody else won? Yeah, AJ, if you go to the Facebook what page... What did they do it, to win it? You just had to share the post and I just picked them. I picked them ram randomly. What, what AJ's doing, if you feel like liking our page, is he's doing special promotions, uh, kind of like a lottery thing, where you get to win a prize that he'll put up. So, like, and how do you, when they like, well, how do you, yeah, just enter them into this random generator or whatever it is? Yeah. And uh, so if you feel like that, you could win a Pac-Man game or whatever else he puts up as a prize. For free! So that'll be good. But anyway, we should get as many people as possible to like the fa Facebook page boost it up and whatever and we're not going to spam your Facebook we'll just post uh, when we get cool stuff in or, or whatever alright so I mentioned that uh, where were we before that I don't know well, we were talking about how hard it is to open a store just to, to initially find the place like we wound up going how many times did you go through looking for a oh, store oh wait today Tuesday today's yeah. Tuesday Ooh, my pages house had 50 cent wings oh uh, there you go if the place Daryl if we, if we could ever get you out it's close to the storage by pages house you like wings they, yeah. They're 50 cent wings on Tuesdays, 75 cents. Throw them some free advertising like anybody would care. And Anthony, how, how good were the wings? You actually went there. They're very good. They're very good. And they're and only 50 cents. And also, I go there and I get like, like 20 of them. They also have like all different kinds of flavors. And then on Saturdays, if you like boneless, they do chicken tenders. When you get them in the sauce, yeah. they're 50 cents as well. They're so good that place. I've been there and normally I, I what I do that. is oh, I get like 20. I tried, I tried the, the, the dessert for the first time. Which dessert? The Toll House Pie. Toll House Pie. It comes out hot. It comes with a big scoop of ice cream. It was so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. AJ likes dessert. I do. Um, we discovered something at um, Taco, Taco Bell. Bell. What was it? Sorry. We normally like the caramel apple yeah, and bananas. Yeah. If you ever get a chance to try those, nice and warm. They really? Really never even heard of it. They're really good. Really? But they have this kind of cinnamon thing, right? And it has like cheese in them or something? Cream. It is cream. They have... Uh, is that where you went before here? Yeah, we figured really? we'd eat. Yeah. It only took us a few minutes, you know. No, you had to eat. Yeah. yeah, we didn't want to eat while we were here. You yeah. know. Oh, camera. Uh, I'm sure it's still recording. It's probably just changed over to. Uh, yeah, it's it's it zeroed out again. Yeah. I got these bifocals. I'm not used to them. Like uh, normally, I don't wear glasses all the time, but since I'm messing with the camera, I need to see things today. So yes, uh, they're called kitchen and beer bar. Kitchen and beer bar. Yes. Well, this is different. What town? Pasco, New Jersey. Haskell, New Jersey, folks. Yeah, Different than that place. What's that other place? The yellow place? What's that? Would you have one of us to bring some Taco place? Bell? Or? Yeah, sure. Damn it. What's the name of that place that you go in? They, it's it's like a sports place. And you, well, Buffalo Wild Wings. Buffalo, yeah. I went there and they had these wings. They had the, the you know, bonus wings. They put them in like garlic sauce. It was so good. But I got so many of them. Boy, was I messed up. Well, what I normally do is I get 20. Then I ordered and the next time I cents. went, I ordered the hot ones. And boy, they were hot. And I just got like 15. The problem is we went there. Pardon me. They didn't have any, so get... any Coca-Cola. They didn't have hardly any drinks. No? So we were like, you know, then they, they forgot our order. The manager came out and started apologizing to everybody. 
because they didn't have people's orders coming yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good restaurant, but if you if you run a shit. Then what happened is I went and I we got a to go order out there and 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 they were so dry they didn't have anything on them. I was sucked, man. Yeah, normally what I do when I go to his. I had a lot of bad luck with the place. Yeah. I like it though. He had the the place he's talking about. I get that they have the 50 cent wing special. So what I do is I get like 20. I eat about eight. I can't eat like these. This guy here. Uh, get him with bone. Steve. Bone no, I get him with the bone. How many? How many does Steve eat? Like 15. Yeah. Yeah. You eat what? About 15. Too. 15. So I eat about I eight, and I save the rest for the, the wife and the kid. Yeah, but that's really pushing it. It's like, why do you want to eat that many? You know, it's, it's too much food. Depending on the sauce, because I'm gonna, be, you know, with this weird thing, I'm gonna be messed up. Well, I what I did was the last time I went there. Uh, I went, no, I didn't go there. I went someplace else. That's no, so that, that night, my son could really go topsy turvy. Yeah. Her. Well, when I you eat to too careful. much, you know? I have to be careful what I eat. Yeah. I gotta, I gotta, I wanna join that gym. I keep saying it. I wanna join the gym. Oh, you got some exercise. But, uh, I don't know about I you. I got a gym in the basement. I want to go to the gym in the basement. Oh, I, I'd yeah. come to your basement and I'll work out. <laughs> It'll be free, right? <laughs> They'll be like, what's this guy working out in the basement? You know what I, got in this I like to work out you, naked. What I got in the basement really. that you might be interested in? I have, a, t I have a, a display, a Thomas the Tank Engine display. It's a store display. It, I what can you put in it? It has Thomas the Tank Engine in it. It, 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 it goes Does like, that slot to put stuff it, in? It, go, it, it has a motor car that goes and it, it, it loads everything. It has these little balls that load. Wow. It's something that I think in the future you might want to sell. Yeah, I mean, it might be a thing we could sell for you. It's worth a few hundred dollars. Yeah. You know, it's a thing that came out of Toys R Us. So One thing I want to emphasize. So it's like, you know, <laughs> specific. But did you sell off all, all the displays that you had at the con or no? He was selling that stuff like mad. Um, all your pamphlets no, and stuff? No, I still have the displays. I still have some that are stuck under the couch in a box that you got to when I give, this, give you to this for the store. What, the glass, like the arcade can, ones? Or? Yeah, the arcade ones. There's still some. I got Metal Slug in there. I have, um, uh, what is it? <coughs> Super Sidekicks, too. Hey, I'm going to... They're under the couch in a, in a very elongated box. I have to be able to get it out. So I'm, I'm going to interrupt this They're for a second. Kid, we'll get it out. Because we're going to take a vote. Do you uh, put the signs up yet? No. No, we didn't do nothing yet. Uh, I'm going to take a vote. Where do people like the podcast better? In the kitchen or the living room? <laughs> vote. Now. Or when I post the video, vote kitchen or the living room. I never even played this. I think if there's more people, then it has to be the living room. We're gonna right. have that challenge where you get to play. So you let me know when you want to do that podcast. Okay. Gonna, I mean, it's not we a problem. We do more than one that whatever. Well, where's the switch for this now? Right All I gotta do is I'll just there's, walk. There's, there's a again. plug. There's a, a what do you call switchboard? Oh, Squirrels going nuts. Out of there? No, it's laying under there. I don't know if you hear the squirrels oh. are going nuts. It's a plug, you know, one of those, one of those boxes that you switch yeah, yeah, yeah. in. The, the real switch for it is hey, let, me, back let me just do it. I'll turn this so on. In order to get to it, you got to pull this out. I want to show you what you're talking about. You probably can't see it. Where we just put the switch down there to get it on. Really? Yep. All right. I got my stuff over one I'm just going to show this for a second. Daryl has a full-on Sega Daytona USA in order our, for me to get over this, the chair has to, this has to be moved. There's the chair. Here, and I gotta get my uh, there's this pack that stuff. I've been it. wanting to play it again, man. Here's but a, I haven't had a chance because it has to be taco nice for me to do it, you know? I taco mean, slot. Put machine. it this way. There you guys come if you want me to play. So I'll, I'll be playing really basically one leg. Yeah. Coca Cola bottle. Because I don't my left just leg. This, I can't in this kitchen, it's got a full on Daytona USA. The trick, the trick for this game is to hit the brake and slide the car around the corners. That's your trick. Yeah, I had to take that apart to get it in here. Yeah. How long has it been in here? At least over a year yeah. now. Over a year, for sure. I know I did play it one wow. time. And who's buying this from Joe, right? No. No. You were searching for this, and then... Daryl's funny. Like, he, uh, stuff like this will come up all the time, because he was always looking for it. And every time we'd come up, he's like, oh my god, I would love to have this. Uh, I don't know if I'd be able to get it. I don't know how clean it would be. I don't know how much work I'll put in. I don't know how much the guy wants. I'm going to see if I can make a deal. I forget and what town I bought it from. It was down south. I think it started with an L. How much did you pay? I mean, pay kind of I paid think up for it, right? I paid about 800 for it. Yeah. How much is it worth? Probably about the same amount. Um, did you buy it like pristine perfect? Yeah, like it's, and never, it's never been an arcade. It has and didn't the guy have two? It has very limited plays because it was never set into yeah. coin. But the guy had a, he the had left two. and the I right. Wanted, I wanted the left one. I yeah. wanted both. But yeah. he sold the other one. Be, my original agreement was for me to buy the other one. Right. How much were you charging? And for that both? was number actually number two. This is number one. 
that's the original agreement because he want he put that one up for sale first. It was the first one I found. Uh. And then he, he got iffy about oh I got another buyer. Oh, if you can't come now. He said you gotta come tomorrow. That's how I, I would look, be. Man, I gotta set up to get there. I just yeah. can't come pop over there. Yeah. I had to figure out well, how am I gonna get this thing home? Well, you would have to get you a know? van or something, right? Yeah, he said get a sprinter van. And so then where did. it was located to get it out, he had a pool yeah. and he had this rock area hmm. that he couldn't get the machine. He told me that when he sold that when he had four guys come there and they lifted it he said two guys. If yeah. four guys this thing's eight hundred pounds. Sure. Okay. Four guys at that point going over. That a, sounds more believable. What did they do? Hover it over the pool? Yeah. He told me that the four, that two guys put it in their van. I said, man, I couldn't lift there with two guys, man. I was lucky that I took it all apart. It's like I went on the, I went on the internet and I found a guy that took this apart. Right, he got oh. into his house. So I watched all his his, his pictures. So you went and there. I studied his pictures. I took it all apart when I got there, yeah. and I put it in the caravan. Thank God for the caravan. Did you all by yourself? It. My father helped me somewhat. Okay. He didn't have any keys for it when I got there. I had to draw all the locks out. Serious? Yeah. Uh, then I had to replace them. So I'm like, what do you do with the keys? Mm. You know? <laughs> and and, and mm. then, then what happened is, I, for what I did take apart, everything, I took everything apart. See, everything. Mom's her out. Go to the secondhand Daisy and if you want to see. I just filmed it with the cat. With when I got there, he was rushing me. He says, I got to go somewhere. I got to go somewhere. So you told me I have all day to take this thing apart. Yeah. It took about 40 minutes to take this thing apart. That's Which not is bad, fast. man. Yeah, that that's bad. bad. I don't know. Just before my father passed here, he went and he helped me. Yeah. You know, <laughs> take the sides and stuff. A lot of the heavy parts did it myself. You know, he was older. Yeah. No hard from the lift. Sometimes you just need somebody to I bring this up to you by myself. The 90% of the part. How price. many pieces did it break down into? Wow, at least 15 pieces. 15. So 800 divided by 15? <laughs> <laughs> the only way for me to sell this is I would have to have somebody come and take it apart the same way. Yeah. I would have to tell them. Detail by detail. How to take it apart. The hardest other part was is that I used security bolts. Security bits. So you had so to buy the So I had to buy the tool. security bits. I went down there with like three different sets of them. And oh. it kept breaking. Huh. So I had to use another one. Did you know that one. might be a problem where they would break? Yeah. Oh. I, I, I thought about it. So what happens if it breaks? So, yeah, so yeah, I yeah. bought extras. Yeah. Then to put it together, even with putting it together, it started to break. It, they get, oh, yeah, but then you're at home. Weak, so, yeah. yeah. I mean, I you were actually... Daryl's a I very a prepared of guy. From, um, he thinks, freight. thinks things through. Harbor Freight. That's where I got him from. It's pretty when good. you were watching the video of the guy that took it apart, actually, he didn't make a video. He made pictures. He has a website. He just shows just pictures on how he took. Did it Did you apart. make a video how to take it apart? And I did together? make a couple videos. Yeah. So if you want to see what it was and how to take one, I'm, this I'm only machine one apart of two together. people in in the world basically that has taken one of these apart and got and it put in it their, together. In their What's the name of the video of people watching it? Twenty-nine inch to a twenty-nine inch doorway. That's the part, the hardest part, getting that to a 29 inch right. doorway. What's the name of the video in case people want to watch what oh, you did? Well, if we have something with Daryl, it's not video game, you know, video, video game. Video gamer Daryl. It would be Daytona 2. Day t day t just Daytona 2. It would be Daytona 2. Do you write anything like title like this? There's a lot of pictures and stuff showing how it's going to work. Okay, so if, also, in case you're curious how complicated difficult it was for Daryl to take apart. This machine to get it up a one-story well, walk really, up. I really wanted to have like the camera like that doing it, but it was timely for me to take it apart. It took me sure. longer. Well, they did it really fast. I bought forward. it here and I yeah. put it in the basement and I built it in the basement and right. I played it down there for about a month. But I get water down there, so I got nervous. And, and your basement flooded. Here. Does it still yeah. flood or no? No, it, it's a possibility. Yeah, because your basement literally flooded uh, knee high. One time or waist high. Waist high. I lost everything. Luckily, I didn't have no arcade machines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that Neo Geo down at Woodgrain. I basically want to give that away. I mean, if you think you What's wrong with it? It needs a monitor, and I have two boards in there. So if you got some, I have the converter to put an LCD monitor. Mm -hmm. If you think you can get somebody to do it, there's an LCD monitor down there, too. If you think you can get somebody to do it, man, you can have that machine. I'd give it to you for free. The yeah. board, the board down you. there. The board's down there. Are, did, you see, did you see it? When, 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 when nah, it you can look later if you want before I leave, I'll take a picture, and I'm gonna post it on Facebook. Somebody could do it. Somebody could do it. We'll just come and pick it up one day. Is yeah. that is that heavy? That one, or did they, you and Chris did do that one? I bring it down here by myself. And then Chris helped you. I have a cart down there, so if they didn't need, they don't need a cart if you get somebody to pick it up. You know, um, I got two boards. The second board in there is is I paid 150 dollars for. It. Well, what board is it? I have one sock board, and a two sock. Two sauce board. If you took the two sauce board out there, you'd probably get a few hundred dollars for that two sauce board. It's beautiful. We should, a Anthony. Okay. This is a business talk meet. Well, uh, we're gonna have a business side conversation. 
Because if you can get a face, if you, we we should talk about it. You might be able to get a monitor for it. And too. honestly, I, I I know somebody can fix it. You know digital press. Leo will fix it if I call him in. Yeah. I tell him, look, if he'll come in, he'll charge us like a few hundred dollars to fix it. We should talk about it after the video, and then go check it out because we I do want something in the in the store, okay. and that machine would be perfect for in the store. It's a Neo Geo. That's yeah. what people want to play. Like people it, that know the system exists. No, it's not that. Yeah. It's just Neo Geo, right? Are they so yeah. famous for our, for yeah. arcades? And another thing too is I have a bunch of games for that. I would be able to sell you a game for it. You'd be able to sell us games for it too. And, and uh, they change out the games. We change out, change out the games on different games. Yeah, we'll games. talk about it. <laughs> we'll talk about it after the video. <laughs> it's a good idea. I want well, well, the stop board because I want to put a multi card in it so that you have all the games on the multi card. That was my goal. Just How much did you pay for that machine? I paid about four fifty. And what happened? I got it Probably down there. And I got it it under when I brought it home, the monitor didn't display right, so I started to work on a monitor. I was going to put a cap kit on it. And then I found out the sound wasn't working right. Working right. Then when I thought maybe the board was bad to, because the display was wrong. It right. was too small. So I looked into it, and then they said, check the board, check your wiring. I, I put a brand new power supply in it, and then I said, you know, i got to get this monitor fixed. So I said, well, I'm going to just put an LCD monitor in it. I bought the computer. So I, was done. I got sick before I could even finish it. Yeah. And then um, I bought a secondary board to make sure that it wasn't the board. I mean, you get you probably get 200 bucks for that board, but you took that alone just to get money back, you know what I mean? To get, you know, from your repair, you know? Yeah. Well, um, you may want to keep, keep the secondary board in case there's a problem with the original board, I suppose. Yeah, you would probably want to do that. So the is, there, is there any games in it or no? Did come with a game? He was going to get a multi card. No, he, there's a multi, there's a game downstairs that I would give you with it. It's a Shock Trooper game. Oh, I like that um, game. It's a good game. But he, he said uh, his goal was to get a multi card, so you could probably steal I, I took the multi card out of that machine over there to put downstairs. Oh. To put it in that machine. Eventually it was going to come up here eventually. But, sure. it, you know, one of those things I've got to be strong to do it, you know. I was going to bring, I was going to fix it down there, bring it up here. See, see that uh, SNK over there? Is that like new or old? That's that's newer. Newer? Japanese. Does Japanese it take Does Japan. it take coins or? Yeah. And it, and is it Americanized where you can like read? That it? eventually is going to go to him. Right. I can tell you that it's eventually going to go to him. Something like that might be fun. I think it's perfect for him. No, what's downstairs the same exact thing. Oh, is it? Except it's Neo Geo. But no, no, that's Neo Geo too. Oh, it is. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the one in, that's downstairs is just a secondary yeah, unit. Because that has wheels and on it. And then the one in there, secondary unit too. They're all different ones. Oh, okay. I think this would be. Oh my God, Daryl, I got, I got to take a picture of it before I leave because Paul Solo wanted it. We remember who's fighting you for it. Which he Paul? Him. Which Paul? Oh, I don't know. We you have to edit this video now. You have to take no, I don't. Part. No, yeah. I don't. Because we didn't say anything. Just don't say anything. Well, he was fighting him. Over Paul was supposed to pick it up. Oh, he was. Know? And I bought it. I didn't really know about him wanting, but he had posted that he wanted it, and I already had a, you know, kind of made an agreement with the guy to go get it. When I got there, the guy wasn't there, and the area was very iffy. Yeah. There was people across the street having a fist fight. Oh, okay. So I got in there, went in the basement, and the house looked like he was renovating the house. So I was kind of scared when I got in there. I was like, this yeah. looks like, like I'm, you know, I'm going to get cash. I thought I was going to get robbed. Yeah, or raped at least. They got in the basement, and, I, and we carried it upstairs and put it in the van. I didn't even use my car. Can, can it fit in the van? Possibly. It's his van, yeah. Which one, the red or the, or the silver? Well, Mike, I have a cab I'm, so. I'm just wondering. Oh, if it fits in yours, then it'll fit in my cell I'm just wondering because we have to rent one anyway, but I'm just wondering if it would fit in your van. Oh, he said it would fit. Arca you know I fit arcade machines in my in my cars before? In my, like, he says it, it fits in his, his, his My silver car is much it's like It's really his not car. that hard because I have the key right here. You can take the key, open up the back door. There's a lock on there. And then you pull your van up. And then oh, you, wow. there's a cart down there. All you'd have to do is just bring it up, the tool you use, bring yeah. it up. Okay, Does guys, strap on there? you might have to edit out because of the other things. So no, you know. that's a, we didn't say nothing. That's, it doesn't I matter. I said the name. It doesn't matter. No? No. I'm just, sure. just watching this. I didn't, this only I like didn't stab him for it. He just didn't go and buy it. Yeah. He had something that he had lost interest or something. I think he wanted a lower price. Yeah, that's probably it. I so really you wanted it more than he did. Who cares? What happened is, the deal with that was, is when I, I went, I, I was looking for another machine. And I was looking for the wood grain machine because I had one. There's a picture on the side of the refrigerator of my other wood, um, wood grain machine, right? If you want to see it, right? And I, and I sold that, I believe, to too many games when I had to move. I said, when I come here... Yeah. So when I come here, I'm eventually, I'm going to buy another machine. And I, I sold my tool stuff to my friend down in Maryland. 
So I said, I want to have all the machines this is that, baby I, that I... Yeah. <laughs> Now what what that, what is this machine? That's the same one that's in the basement. And the same one as yeah. that? No, in the basement. The wood basement. Oh, so you have one. That's a Goldie. Oh, okay. Neil Goldie. So I says I want to buy another one. So when I went to the doctor, I told my wife I'm looking at this machine on Facebook. I want to buy. It. If we go to the doctor, the doctor told me that I have good news with the cancer. So when I got there, they told me that it's removable. So so this is good news, man. I went right there the next day. We went. We bought the machine. Yeah. You know, and it's not assembled, though, right? Is it? Yeah. It was you did together. assemble? Oh. No, it was all put no, together. No, no, it's a standard. Oh, we'll, 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 I'll go downstairs with you and check it out and okay. talk about it. If, it. if we do want it, what we will do for you, Daryl, I'm going to talk for you now, because you probably will say do it for him. Yeah. As what we're going to do for you, you said you have shock, shock troopers two in there, right? One. One? Oh, no, um, uh, it's either one or two. No, I think it's two. All right, so... Basically, what 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 are we gonna do for you is, we'll, we'll give you the hundred bucks for the for the game. Yeah, when you buy the game, yeah, that'd be cool. We'll, we'll, we'll buy the game and then we get the capsule and get some money back. You know what I mean? Because I feel bad to just take it off his hands. Right. Yeah, definitely. So okay. so so we, we will give you a hundred bucks for it. Yeah. So at least you know, at least you get some money. We'll split that fifty fifty. Okay. Because it's for the store, be on our our side. It'll be ours. It'll be yeah. ours together. Okay. And then if you ever want to, if you ever want to uh, divorce me, we can figure something you, out. You just pay me what I pay. Yeah, basically. Yeah, whatever I pay. Yeah. Yeah, if it. you want it. Well, after we fix and everything, we're probably gonna put in, I think about three hundred into it. Okay. Well, if we we split, it's cheap. if you ever say, hey, I want to take it home, yeah. it's got the coin like, in it, and I have there's a coin box downstairs for it. Wow. So you could be able to you know, catch coins and make you money, you know. And, and and that's the best thing about it. Okay. I had a trial run with that. Get cabinet. some money back, maybe. I put that cabinet. Make some money. I put, that's what I said. It's I had smart. a trial run with that cabinet. I put that. I put that cabinet, the, the other one there. Yeah. I put it in the restaurant. Of course, she did. Me. Yeah. And and I and it was um, it was a uh, a restaurant for for Brazilians. Hmm. And I put soccer games there. And oh. Man, okay. It made it kill kill Yeah. I, I I um, the person had a license. At the place for arcade machines, you know, you gotta have your special license if you're gonna make money for that. Remember? Oh, okay, you hear that? They don't press them. Oh well, all if right. you gotta That's make it, you gotta vending license. We would get the vending license. Okay. Yeah, and they had that vending license because they had the gumball machines in there and stuff. I had so I split it with them. So I was making money. I did a trial run because I wanted to have a route. What were you making? Fifty a week. Yeah, it was right. good, man. It was they were Adds killing up. them, man. They were making, they were playing them to soccer games and your super sidekicks. Yeah, that's you know, uh, like I would sell. The only sports games soccer I games generally consider really, soccer games are really good. When I buy sports in, in, games, it's in, soccer. A, in a Brazilian kind of yeah. place well, that buys soccer. How would a multi car really work? Soccer. Soccer. It would be okay. Yeah, because I, I would. Oh, I would. I would, I would sell you the multi car too because my multi car yeah, has been modded to yeah. to fit in the machine to work yeah, properly. Yep. Daryl has everything. That's two things I would do for you when you when you take that machine. I'll show you a multi cart that's already been fixed to fit. And how much is that? About uh, about a hundred bucks. Okay. Because I, I I fix I, at the time when I was getting the multi carts, I was fixing them so that they actually fit the motherboard because they don't fit properly. Hmm. Then you get all kinds of issues with it. I have a couple videos up on that, but <laughs> to find that you would have to search multi cart. Yeah. You know, G O M B S multi cart. Used to Daryl used to do again, a lot of searching. Again, it was a lot more pictures I took with that than showing the video of what I was doing. Because that the take the you have to take the board. The problem that the internal boards are too big. So you have to take them. I got to take a drum. We got to shave off a little bit of the side so they slide in. Right. They won't slide in. It'll make a good contact. Huh. You know. So I, I showed a lot of people how to do it on the internet because otherwise they don't fit. These are basically ready to go. Yeah, it's ready to go. Oh, and, yeah. then the, and then the machine, like I said. I'll get some pictures, I'll talk to Leo, he'll, he'll do me a favor. He doesn't charge it. He fixed my Mario machine. Uh -huh. Remember my Mario machine? He did a cap job, he did. He fixed it all up. Uh, he'll only charge me 170 Oh, that's cool. So, I mean, and, and he'll come... And he's to, a cap kit, so he can do... He does he'll come cap to, kits, he yeah, can fix he does that. It. He'll come to us, too. As long as he's had it somewhere, he'll come back to us. Yeah. Okay. Most likely, he needs a cap kit that will fix the color, to fix the size. You might need a width coil you know, or but something. But it turns on and everything. He can do that, yeah. I don't know what they're talking about. It, with, uh, it, work, it, it works, but it needs something to be done with that monitor. Yeah. Monitor's got to be fixed. So have I mean, a, if we the use picture is too so small. No, yeah. it has an LCD monitor. No, it's got a regular CRT monitor. I thought monitor. said that we can use but LCD. I, but you can put one in. I have an LCD monitor down there you can take with you. I probably have a bunch Then of I have the converter there. that you he has converter. Leo uh, can do that. I, that was the last thing I bought a eBay. Yeah, I, I, I would use that LCD. When I was actually in the hospital, 
When I was in the hospital after the stroke, that came yeah. in the mail. Did it? Yeah. Yeah, I would go with the LCD monitor, LCD, right? Yeah. So if it's sitting on top of the machine down there. It'll use electri less electricity. Yeah, It'll make the unit it. lighter. Yeah, probably about like 30 pounds lighter. So Leo will do that work. Oh, I'll, I'll retire from him. Leo digital press. of Digital Press in Springfield, the owner. He does arcade work. That's the he second digital that one, press. Huh? He owns that one. Who he owns says the other one? Joe. Joe owns that one? Yeah, it's Wait a franchise. So the, oh, so Joe doesn't own the other It's other? a franchise. So he's, he, he owns the name, so Leo leases the name. Ah, like okay. Yeah. So so Leo works. Does Leo have it? arcade machines in there? Yes. He has the Mario Pinball, the nice one. Never see that one? Wow. He has that in there. It's nice. You've been in there? No, I saw a picture. I gotta go down there. Yeah, he wants to go. But uh, what he does is fix arcade machines. And a lot of people have used him. I'll, I swear by him to fix. He fixed oh, his handhelds too. He does mods on this. Nice. He did a mod on this for me. Are you going like, to get that one modded or not? I, I already I mean, I mentioned to Leo, if we ever have consoles that need to be fixed, yeah. I'm probably going to call him and be like, I always have a bunch of consoles. I've seen that, something that he fixes Saturn's. He well, fixes without everything. Without Daryl helping me, I got Turbo all this Turbo, CDX, the Coleco, the, the Mini Arc, he fixes everything. I have a bunch of Xbox 360s that don't work, but they're probably not worth getting fixed. It's probably away. Yeah, I, I, I think we should just smash them. Yeah, them. we could smash them. If, if it were legal to shoot Ryan stuff in this state. Ryan wanted to buy a bunch of systems from me. Yeah. One time so he could smash them. Yeah. I think it was him. Well, if I get a sledgehammer at a yard sale or something. One of the guys was... One of the smash, guys I we'll make a video called Smashing My Non-Working 360. You want to buy a bunch of systems from me so you can smash them. I, I felt bad because I was like, oh my god. A lot of these like old Genesis I felt bad. I didn't want to smash. No, nah, I wouldn't want to smash those. The three sixties, no. boy. I got a whole bunch of those. I was thinking like if once we have the shop, just stuff that I don't want to deal with, making a free box. So I just could not see them. smashing those old retro systems. Like no, I wouldn't do that. You know, because yeah. there's always something that could be saved on them. Somebody, uh, I got some email from. Uh, Another thing that you're eventually going to get for me too is my Vectrex collection. Oh, uh, your Vectrex? Well, you have one, right? So mm -hmm. we we'll buy it for what? The store or to yeah. sell? That's a, and my microvision. You gotta look at microvision. That's the first handheld. Mm -hmm. Do you yeah. know anything about microvision? I know a little bit. Because I got a big collection of that. Box systems, box games. Yeah, I know mostly like uh, mainstream stuff. I'm not like uh, a hardcore. You didn't put that that, that that um. You didn't put the uh, pinball game in here, man. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna buy that. No. No, I th I'm thinking of if. Yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, I'll at talk least, to you after. Yeah, at least not today. At least right? not today, but, yeah. but... We're laying out a lot of money, folks. But, hold on. But, if I go downstairs, we'll all look, we'll look, we might leave you a down payment for that. That might be leave you a down payment for sure. so you have the money already, and that's basically it. If I like it, because I was talking to even Paige about it, I'm like, we need an arcade machine. Oh, you were just talking... No, no, I was talking to her the other day. And I'm like, maybe put the one in my room, but my room doesn't take coins. So we can get one that takes coins. And maybe make some money. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think I, I'm going to just check. I think it just kind of cycles. Yeah, are you going to send me a down payment through PayPal? I'm, I may have extra money on me. Okay. Oh, man. Any cash yeah. you give me, I'll give you whatever hundred, cash man. I can find. <laughs> you can find. What are you going to check, like, your secret pocket? Bungle. And, <laughs> and then remember. It's like in a prison. Time out. <laughs> well, remember with the arcade machine, it's going to be half your win whenever. I don't care. It could be next year you pay me for it. Yeah. I don't care. When but we'll figure it out. I don't care. You know, like, uh, like, like right I, now we're I all laying care. out a lot of money, so yeah. we're all kind of broke, well, right? Well, I don't care to put it out for Daryl. It helps some person. We'll help sure. our store. Just picture. We'll, we'll, be, don't, we'll be like that. the... Steve, Steve will be so happy. He loves Neo Geo too. He'll probably be, well, he'll be taking breaks between listing. He and probably playing. would play it. He loves Neo Geo. Well, I, do, uh, I gotta, I gotta play, play, I gotta play some uh, Neo Geo now. The sticks are brand new and the buttons are brand new, and it's got a brand new overlay on it. When you see it over, it's a lot of overlay. It's nice. That's yeah. why I want to go check it out when yeah. we're done. Yeah, we'll go check it out. Cause Steve, I'll, I'll, I'll take, I'll, I'll take a video. Steve's I'll, idea. I'm gonna take a video so you can see what yeah. we'll be getting, and I'll yeah. add it on to the other yeah. video. Probably just like excerpts. One trick you gotta do is just put Bitcoin door lock. And it won't be on second hand days. Like it's coming resellers. And I'll call it excerpts, uh, scenes that you couldn't see. At um, close and then so also the arcade machine will be on my YouTube. I'll film it and say we're going to put that. Yeah, in that's the right. That's and right. I'll make a video for Leo. And and also make a video for a Facebook page. Yeah, for Leo. For him to, to for yeah, him Leo, to but also the Facebook page yeah. too, right? Remember, folks, like our Facebook page. I've got a link in what every video. Oh uh, my God, Daryl! I just really I just, I just have an idea for the for the Facebook page. I'm going to say, uh, this just in. We had a house call, and we got a new house house call. machine. I'm going to say that. Can I yeah. say that? Yeah, Everybody, right. Everybody's going to be like, huh? Oh. Uh, coming a Neo Geo machine. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the link to our Facebook page oh, will be. Funny. In the description, right? 
about uh, uh, the GoFundMe for video game with Daryl. Oh. If that girl, you like you throwing Daryl some money. Value for, she, for she wanted to buy it. Uh, wanted I think buy it. she wanted to buy it. It's like there's two poker machines down there. I mean, if you, think you, can, you think you can do anything with poker machines? You can take them for free. Well, I don't know. That's kind of like gambling. Yeah. Uh, is it like, uh, I mean, no, you can do it for you, fun. No, you don't want money on it. It's for fun. Okay. Yeah, well, then, yeah, fun. okay. Uh, I mean, maybe we'll hey, you want to put slot machines? She, no, she because fixes she probably them couldn't. Or her husband fixes them. He fixes them, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, if we could just do it for fun, if okay. Play, if you let me know you want to play any slot machines, he goes, I'll give you But if you do anything too. that pays out or something, then it's real yeah. complicated. You but slot machines, that's for amusement only. Yes, like, if, if they don't like what you're doing, they'll shut you down. for amusement only. Yeah. You don't put coins in them, you use them. But sometimes that's like a red flag. Like cops will come in and they'll be like, hey, I just won. Like they'll do undercover crap to see if you pay out and everything. So you have to be careful with that kind of stuff. There was a store that was across the street when I lived in Union City, and he was doing slots and kind of paying out. And well, uh, you're going to buy pretty much all of them. I have two pinball machines. I mean, you want to put pinball machines in your shop? No. It kind of depends on how much room we have. A one arcade machine should be fine. I would say at the very least one arcade machine. Would they wanted to buy everything from me. Yeah, uh, they they had put those poker machines up for sale for me. Who did? They did, Christine. Oh, okay. And they were going to sell them for me. And then she said she was to buy the Neo Geo. I just never got it. I just never went fully through the deal. Yeah. They were going to come buy the Neo Geo for me for like five hundred. They were yeah. going to buy five hundred from me yeah. because they were going to pay me a little bit more than I than I paid for it. Okay. And they were going to take the two other machines. And I said you can take those two other machines for free if you pay this for five hundred. Watch this. For us, we're being coming to resell it again for a hundred. Well, no. that's the start. It's just the start. Yeah. You said you're going to buy some games off in the summer. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because he'll be our source to get the games. Daryl's our brother, basically. He's like our brother games. from another mother. So basically, you make money. How long have I known you? Now. No. I go go well, by the kids. Well over 10 years. Yeah. Could be over 10 years. Well, years well, I'll put it this well, way. I, got, I, I can go by Hold Nick. On. It's like, 2019. I really started talking to you a lot. Time out. When Nick I'll tell you, it's 2019. I met you in like six years ago. I met you guys six years ago. I saw ago. Nick Post say he's up in Westbury. What's he doing up in Westbury? Oh, comedy. He's doing comedy. He actually... Uh, Nick Petito, uh, go to his YouTube channel, subscribe. He's an impersonation film. He's also on an internet show, Facebook show called Wise Guy, The Wise Guy Show. Um, he's been performing live at the Gotham. Uh, Wednesday night is coming up. I don't know if it's this Wednesday or next Wednesday or something. Mm -hmm. But the last week he went, if you were there in the stage, Nick, Nick actually uh, opened up for um, Jerry Seinfeld. He did, he did a stand-up routine, and Jerry Seinfeld made a surprise appearance. Really? Was live there. Yeah, you didn't know that? You didn't see it on Facebook? Yeah, I heard about it. Yeah. He told me about it. So he did his performance. So literally, he kind of opened up for Jerry Seinfeld, you know, um, which was amazing. I, I almost had a chance to go to that one, but it just didn't work out for me, you know. I had to go to my, my I went to my daughter's art show, and then we had talked about possibly going after, but Marie's knees were killing her, and just, you know. She's got like uh, screwy knees. One trick too is when you do come. So to much walking machine, when you're going to say. I think it'd be best on Tuesday. Just don't do it on the weekend because I get somebody parks in front of the door. Yeah. Usually during the weekend. On the weekday. No. Usually during the weekend we're all busy. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe they were selling or shopping or selling or shopping or something. It probably yeah. be maybe it'll be like a Wednesday or Thursday. We'll, we'll, we'll let you know. It'll be early in the morning though. We'll come in the morning and do it. Yeah. It'll be at night. Also too, we're gonna have to do like a thing. I'll, I'll tell you something. On the back. Is the board is the whole board? I got screws in it. Right, you gotta bring a Phillips head screwdriver. Yeah, that. And then yeah. you take the back off so you get that extra board out of there. Because okay. it's laying on top of the other board. It's actually an excellent way around. of storing it. You don't that. want it to fall and get smashed. Yeah. You know. Yeah. That's one thing I'll tell you about now, so you remember that. Very smart I can't way to get it. down there. As I, soon as we I, get the, down, I don't smart. know at that time. I mean, it would be a miracle if I got cured. You know. You said the doctor said you could basically walk at any time. Um, I, it could happen any time if yeah. all of a sudden my neurological connects again, but uh, yeah, and I think you, I'll be in a wheelchair for the rest of my life. No, 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 no. I'll, put, I'll put it this way. We'll probably pick it up within a week or two. As soon as we get the keys, that's one of the first things. But time I can probably tell probably you this store. much, right? Yeah. If you were able to help me get downstairs, down the stairs, all you have to do is guide me because I can walk with the cane to the point where I, to get downstairs, you have to guide okay. me. I could I have a wheelchair down there, a spare one. Yeah, that's the one in the so basement. That, right? So that get from Michael you can get me shop. down there, I can go down there and direct you, you know, what you okay. can do. Okay. You know what I mean? We'll do that like probably next week. So or that, that way. Like, look. like Laura doesn't care if you sell it? No. This no. way. She probably wants to Probably go. Laura doesn't care. This no, way, no, no, she no, don't care about nothing. Yeah. Um, 
This way, if you walk me, I grab the railing, I go back up if you can help me out. Shit, Lauren know? knows how much you love stuff like that. All you gotta so. do is just guide me so I don't fall over. Okay. We'll make sure you get downstairs. But, yeah. Or we can do that, we can get one of those things, like the front strap, and we'll just, we could hook up to AJ and he can carry you downstairs. Well, if right you would think you can pick up 140 pounds, <laughs> my brother in law is the one that actually picked me up, put me in a wheelchair when I'm Easter. Oh, yeah? He lifted me up, put me in a wheelchair. Huh. Then they lifted up the wheelchair to get outside. I think I could do it, but I think I might regret doing it. <laughs> I got all, you know, I got all kinds of stuff I can pull and sprain and whatever. Well, your brother in law is not that big, right? He's fine. Yeah, but it, he's not that tall he though, right? He picked me up, he, 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 I put my arm around him. Height-wise, he's a little bit taller than you, right? So he's not yeah. a big guy, he's he maybe lift, a big guy. He lifted guy. me up and put me in a wheelchair, and I was surprised. <laughs> he was going to carry me outside and yeah. put me in the van. So then when we got to the stairs, it got iffy, mm. and he thought he was going to lose his That's footing. That's scary, too, you know. So then he put me back in the wheelchair, the he lifted me and put me back in the wheelchair. Don't recommend that, folks, if both of you could be in wheelchairs, you know? You know, I was like, cool, man, I told him, man, I want to, you know... Like Moses there says, you know, you think you can bring me in the house? Yeah. But I don't think I'm doing anything for Mother's Day. After my bad, after my mishap at, at Easter at my Mother's Hall, I couldn't hold my, I couldn't hold my bowels. After that, I don't think I'll be going there for Mother's Day. Well, you never know. I mean, it's like, if they were more prepared, like, you obviously said, hey, you know, and they just didn't take it seriously or something? Or? Yeah, I was like, man, I gotta go, there's no commode there, so I had to go on the uh, bed. You know, I had to go on the bowl. And I, by the time I got there, I couldn't hold it anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It wasn't enough for me. To, it wasn't enough time for me to get there. No, I'll shit my pants all the time. <laughs> you don't have to worry about it. I just fart. <laughs> Sometimes a whip. I'm honest. <laughs> I'm that honest was a too. damn shame about it, man. Well, that's, that's one really, of the complications. That really like, ruins a lot of my future. It's like people don't understand. That what ruins it's like. a lot of my future trips because she doesn't trust me enough to be able to hold it to go in yeah. there. I'm sure there's a, a, a way that you can be prepared for that. I mean, there's always got to be, like, something that could be done. You know, you just have to take it into consideration, you know? So it's very neurological, neurological, too. Yeah. You know? I mean, she tells me, well, if you know you've got to go, you can go, you can hold it. I mean, I see you moving your legs like, all the man, time. I'm like, look, it's like, when it wants to come out, if I, I'm nowhere near the bowl, it's coming out. I you literally know? see you moving your leg all the time. You know? So you, it's just a matter of, That's like... That's my problem. No, nah, I know. But when it comes to your other leg, I see you moving it all the time, Right? So it's just a matter of you being able to move it where you, it, it goes where you want it to go, right? Yeah, I gotta see a neurologist to see if this is connected to my brain, and I can't get an appointment with the guy. No. Some eyebrow guy or something. His name has to be eyebrow. eyebrow. Oh. That's what he nicknamed him, the brow guy or something. I, I have no clue. And I, have to, and I can't get an appointment with him. I mean, put it this way. What they're not going to be able sure to do, sucks. They're not going to be able to do anything for me anyway. He's probably going to give me a scan. They tell me I got a brain scan. What are they going to do? They're not going to. They're not going to give me brain surgery to fix it. No. no so no. they're going to tell you all you have to do is see me. and say yes. Yeah, neurological that you can't walk. That's no. what you're going to say. So that's what you literally think, and then and then no, from there it's just physical therapy. That's just yeah. taking money from the insurance to tell me something that I already yeah. think. You know what I mean? That better not smell, AJ. How do you? <laughs> how do you? You know, a verification of what I already think. Yeah. You know? Yeah. No, I know. It's, it's, I mean, our insurance system, it's a mess. Right now, what I'm going physical therapy is basically to strengthen my leg. I got right. that. I got that. So it doesn't that. do this, too, yeah. right? I don't need the exercise bike anymore. You know, in case Mike and Michelle. That's your ex exercise yeah, bike right brand there. new. Laura built it. We have problems because of the resistance didn't work. Well, it doesn't look like it's very good for balance, I'll tell but you that. But here's the problem about that. See, they didn't, when it was in physical therapy, they didn't let me work my leg out. So I figured myself, if I could strengthen this leg out, that's what I'm going to physical therapy for. Yeah. Strengthen well, the leg. Part of it is so that your muscles don't if ache. If I can feet. strengthen this leg out, I believe I can walk again. But yeah. I don't know, man. Well, yeah. also, you have to be able to, like, like the leg to has control to be, your leg. Yeah, the leg has to be strong enough to be able to hold me up, like right. my right leg. But you also be, have to be able to control it. So you know, basically, it's like you have they, to say, well, okay, I, leg lift. My leg Thursday's lift. physical therapy, what she's doing is basically making me use my cane to walk around the place. That's a start. And it's not really helping me much. No, because, but it's a start. Because you know. I can't, because I'm never going to be able to get out of this house to walk like that. You know? I, I see people with canes and stuff I need all to time. be able to strengthen the leg enough to be able to get up and down the stairs myself. Well, if you, if you start walking, I think that'll happen. You know? Right. And it, if you say you're already kind of walking, I think there's great potential for you to be walking. You know? Shame, because I think you're going to die like this, man. No, I'm not the walking. Dude, you got, you got like probably decades to figure that stuff out you know then I still gotta go for the cancer you know for the radiation 
Are they doing radiation? I got to go for that, but it's going to be an everyday thing. My wife can't get off like that. So what are they going to do? You can radiate my side of my face and this but how, Are they going to do it every day? Every, every day, man. Does that mean you're staying me in the hospital? Me, or? No, they would take me to outpatient. She would take me to outpatient university every day. It's not going to happen. But you have to do it. Why would it not happen? You have she to can't take me there every day. If she it's wants to. Now, she, if, if it's imp- that important, dude, she, she'll, they have to she'll take lose it. her job. Well, then so you just they hire had, somebody. They had it where you can get a van to come here. The problem is I have to be outside in the front for the van to take me in the wheelchair. How am I going to do that? It'll happen. You How am I going to get outside to the wheelchair to go? If something's important enough, you make it happen. You know, you know what, what I mean? mean? It's like, Chris, if Chris is home, do it during the summer. And you just say, Chris, you have to help me get downstairs. Sure, i got to have know? somebody take me. Yeah. you got to have somebody go with you, like an aide or something. I don't have an aide. I, I say, like, summer's right around the corner. Uh, and maybe, like, uh, okay, do you got a vacation week coming up? Your wife? She, that was last week, man. Not her week. The kids, man. It was a blessing they were home. Yeah. At least they were here. It wasn't, you know, full. No, I know. Just sitting around in the house. Now yeah. it's just, I'm just sitting on the couch all day, not doing shit. Sure, sure. I never watched so much Seinfeld in my life. Hell yeah? Is that what you're doing? Just watching Seinfeld? Yeah. Nighttime, I can't sleep, so I just put on... So what do you watch? Show. Seinfeld's on Hulu, right? No, no. It's just regular cable. Oh, really? But I thought it's it on was Hulu, on all isn't day it? Today, then, um... What I watch too, I watch on flea market flip. Oh and yeah. Time I put on the I don't watch flea market flip. Ridiculousness and um. Because that's more like a game over show. Over. That's not like King a flea market Queens show. And stuff. Yeah, King of Queens. I remember that. You know, I, I used to watch that the syndication all night before, long because uh, I can't sleep. I stay up yeah. all very sick all night. Yeah. At six o'clock comes. He comes in there. That's like, what my stepfather up. used to do when he had a stroke. He used he to comes, just like watch She goes to work at six o'clock in the morning, so I hear her leave. I don't know how she gets out of here this early, man. She creeps out of here, man. Seven, you gotta do it. Seven forty, she comes back. She takes the kids, so they were all up. I eat my breakfast, then I go to the couch. Yeah. I stay on the couch all day, and my butt's sinking in the couch. Man. Sure. You understand how badly I was trying to get out of here? I was trying to escape. I was trying to push myself down the stairs. I was slide my butt down the stairs and push the wheelchair down the stairs, and then get it out. Getting outside. out. I was gonna what slide on my back. back. I was slide on my back. Yeah. Outside, and then try to pop the wheelchair open. What about getting right. back in, though? Like if you well, got out, I, get, I was gonna go. I was gonna wheel myself over to CVS and then sit at CVS and then wait for her to come out and yeah. then go home with her. I would not have had the leg brace on, so it was a problem because I wouldn't be able to get up the stairs again. Right, right. But you can take the leg brace off. I didn't. I didn't. I wouldn't. I didn't have it. I was. I. I didn't have it. I would not have had it on. Hmm. I would have had my sneakers. I got as far as getting my sneakers on before my kids caught me and saved me. Uh, you know, to the point where I believe I would have got there or I would have been stuck out in front of the porch. Or would have smashed my you head. got another set of steps. Yeah, it's at the point where how far could I possibly got? I was, I was going to slide down the stairs on my butt. It's good to have that drive. With one I mean, arm, if you, you know? can figure out... So it's something like that I, can, I have to promise myself I never will try. Do you, I mean, do you like watch videos on people in similar situations and see what they're doing for therapy? Or Most people in my situation are pretty screwed. Yeah, but like, do you see what they do for therapy or, or anything? Have you checked that out? Because I'm sure there's... A, a spot on YouTube where people that are in your situation talk about it and what they're doing to help themselves. They're just doing the same shit I'm doing, like going to physical therapy until yeah. it lasts. If I get it once but a all week, they do is physical. I mean, I'll, I'll probably, is there no I'll probably physical therapy? Three, I'll probably have it for about three weeks before they. Is there no they, physical therapy you can do like while you're at at the home or here by yourself? That, that bike, that's it, man. That's I can't it. Do anything else? And and also the exercises that they gave me, you know, but they're not really helping. Yeah. No, well, it's trying to stand it's up a myself, try to stand myself, and try to work this leg, man. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm lose my balance, pull yeah, over. It's yeah, hard. Yeah, yeah. That's something. They have this thing where I gotta grab cups, where I gotta stand there on my own and grab cups and stack them. Yeah. Right, which gives this weight. It helps your balance, basically. You know, but being by myself, trying to do that, man. Yeah, 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 I need yeah. my right arm to hold me up when I'm standing up. Right. So trying to do that, man. I'm top on force, smash my head. Yeah, yeah. You know. I mean, in a controlled setting where you wouldn't fall over. Exactly. you got to have that secondary person hold you up when you're yeah. doing stuff like that. When the physical therapist was here, she was holding me up when I was doing that. Yeah. She would actually hold the cups in her hand, and then I would grab the cup, take it out of his hand, and then when I would topple, she would grab me real quick. But, you know, that was... She didn't do much for me, man. Oh, she I would mean, take me up and down the stairs to practice the stairs. She took me on one day, let me sit in the front, and then it got cold, and then she left. Yeah. She had to take me upstairs. You know, she was chilly. I was fine. I could have stayed out there all day. And a lot of times, it was nice, it's like, you know? what can they really do? It's I'm all, like, it's all this lady skis all the time. And I'm saying, wait a minute. The lady skis all the time. She's worried about the cold. It wasn't even cold. It was a beautiful day. It got a little bit of wind. She got cold. She wanted to leave. I honestly think it was just really, it was one of those excuses. She that is one sport I've never done. 
You ever go skiing? Mm -hmm. I did when I was younger with my uncle. Who'd you go? Your uncle? I uh, went to a ski lodge and I had the opportunity to ski, but then I was like, nah. We went skiing and the, the thing that takes you up, it broke and threw us off. Oh my god. Uh, I just like, I see the agony of defeat where the guy's legs twist off. <laughs> Do you remember that? I don't even know if they show that anywhere. That's well really brutal. Ski. I did pretty like, well skiing back then. It wasn't bad, man. We went to, um, where's that place I've in I've taken PA? lots of tumbles. Where's like, that place in PA that we ski? Mount Air. Mount Air, yeah, I yeah. think it is. That's it. What are you doing? Oh, you're doing pictures of, like... I don't even know if it was Action Park or something. Like that. Remember Action Park? I have a hat. It's, uh, it's I don't think I ever went to Action Park. Park. Yeah, I don't think I, I, think I ever they went to they have skiing. Yeah, they they I grew up in the Bronx, I'm so I right there. like and New York. So I spent most of my time either in the Bronx or Manhattan. Uh, so like New Jersey, I came in like my mid to late twenties. Yeah. Okay, I, I think that's good enough for the week. It's been over an hour and I'm sweating. Yeah, that's because we have the one light. It's killing us. Well, what time is it? Two, two, or three. Uh, I mean, we could just run it until. Yeah, or do, do we like need to, to have, do something? I'd like to have some alone time with Daryl too. We'll okay, on and, and what time do we have to leave? Oh, whenever. But like before four, right? Yeah, because she, yeah. Yeah, you yeah, got you got until four. All right, so I don't think we did much of a topic today. I think we, we mostly just, just rambled. rambled. Yeah. yeah so rambled. stay tuned for our next podcast. We'll be here. We want you to vote to see if you want it in the kitchen or Darryl in the room with about our cake uh, machines. And I, was, I meant AJ. AJ wants to talk about wieners. He likes wieners. Tony still has to do a full view of all my machines. Yep. He might, I will. He might not I'm going to show, well, show some. We're gonna also, today, go to ASAP Zonk to watch the arcade machine video and to and Like our Facebook video. page. Also, like the bonus scenes. Subscribe. That's what, that's what you're going to call it. Yeah. Well, I already did it. I did yeah. the one I did last week, remember? Yeah. And uh, subscribe to Ribbon Run Collectibles. Also, how did my haircut, guys? That looks nice. He, he looks like, uh, what should we call it? Um, Mr. Uh, Magoo? Hardy. <laughs> Who said Mr. Magoo? Who else did you say? Uh, Hardy. Who was that? Laurel and Hardy. Oh. I don't know. Get a little mustache. The only person you remind me of is the guy in Jurassic Park, the guy that did the computer. That's who you always remind me. Oh, I think you I remind me a little bit of the guy on... Um, New, New Seinfeld. You remind me of Seinfeld, the guy Newman. Him, right? Yeah. yeah. Newman. 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 He's that same, I think he's the same guy that played the part he was. in Jurassic Park. Yeah, he was. He was. I don't know he always, now. When I first met him, I said, man, he looks like Newman. You're actually, oh, this guy? Yeah. yeah. I think so. I don't think so. I don't know, maybe. How do you spell Steinfeld? S-E-I-N-F-E-L-D? Newman. Newman. A little bit. You think so? Yeah. I don't think so. A little bit. Yeah. If I had a curly hair. Yeah, if he had curly hair. You probably could do a bit as him. <laughs> you want to be Newman? He's played by Well, oh, I guess I'll be Jerry. Oh, wow. Do you ever notice? <laughs> Look at him. He's actually good. Do you ever notice when you go on an airplane Look. first class? Yeah. This yeah. Yeah. Here. This is, this is what everybody here will show. You get okay. a little bit of grand. Find a picture that looks again. most like you. And just see if anybody thinks yeah, this one. Yeah. What do you think? Is this AJ's doppelganger? <laughs> Is he, do, do you think he could play young Newman in Newman the movie? If they make he it. might make him a Jurassic Park part of yeah, you know, it. You, you know what? what? When Nick of Impersonation films, his career takes off, uh, maybe you'll find a spot for young Newman. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> in his movie. Um, all right, so then you think you just want to call it, be done? Yeah. All right. Uh, I don't know. That's it. I think we... Uh, Oh, stay, stay tuned for next hold week. Hold on, I gotta say something. Yeah. Stay tuned for Rip and Run Collectibles X, Zonx Retro Games, and more. 178 Main Street, Butler, New Jersey. And Joe, not the number one, one fan, Joe, the other Joe. Yeah. I could be as excited as I fucking want. There you go. Don't complain. And like the Facebook page because, I don't know, everybody likes Facebook. Did you watch this? All my friends all the time say, like my Facebook page. I like it. Shout out to Joe, Anthony, the one fan, and my second Joe, friend. Uh, everybody else. Marie, Paige. my wife, Daisy, my daughter. Paige. Uh, AJ's cat. Paige. Paige. You did Paige three times. Why am I going to say Paige? You do. AJ's cat, AJ's mom. Apparently, she's going to clean up the store yeah. after AJ. She doesn't want AJ's underwear all over you the place in the store. You don't this video on Facebook, do you? No. No. Steve and Sandra. Do you want to? Steve and Sandra. No, uh, maybe uh, maybe we'll do clips on the Facebook page. Carmella and Ray. Carmella, Ray. Today's Ray's birthday. He'll never see Happy this. Happy birthday, Ray! Happy birthday, Ray! 
You'll so, never see so this. So you never want to see this? Re- I mean, I, I just don't want to share it to Facebook by accident. If I don't, don't want, put it on Facebook. If you don't want to cool, right? After we're done. I don't have What I'm number. saying is, you, if, you know, sometimes I share your, your videos to Facebook. Just no, no, it doesn't matter. Let me know if you don't want me to share yeah, it to Facebook. No, 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 you could. We don't. Yeah, we don't care. And anything you want to do, it doesn't matter. Cause it's got a good, you know, I got a lot of people that watch what I put on Facebook. Too. Okay. Daryl's helping us out. All right, so uh, that's it. Yeah. For real? Mm-hmm. Okay, I get up. I'm going to turn it off. Yeah. Anybody want to stop me? No, do it. Okay. I'm Here really doing it. Here it goes. Wait I'm going to stop the button, press the button, and we're off.